Tell me something in Jamaican Patwa. You don't know, big up to all Jamaica 14 parishes, it. Yeah, man, Bumba Raska, Tawidis, Global Empress International. We don't really know, big up to all foreigners overseas. Salute. Man, And after 20 years, I'm finally back in Jamaica. My first time in Kingston. I've had so many requests. People telling me, what do I have against Jamaica? I have nothing against Jamaica. I'm excited to be here and I have a special guest, my boy Matthew. Walk one. Wagwan! Welcome David, with your man. You have to get the right lingo right. Nah, I'm Wagwan. learning, I'm learning. Wagwan! Yeah, man. Welcome to Thank Jamra. you so much, bro. Thank you. Yeah, man. So where are we today? Right now, we're in Kingston. We're starting in Kingston, and we have to be at the epic place for food in Jamaica. Food in Kingston, Hero Circle. It's a must start when you come to Jamaica. Hero Circle is one of the places that is famous for their local Jamaican food and also some extreme things that we can get into here. I'm excited. I see yep. crabs everywhere. So many crabs. Mountains of crabs. It is crab season. In Jamaica, how you know it's crab season? Any month that doesn't have R. No R? No R. No crab. No crab. Same go. Perfect. Yeah, man. Let's go right here? Right over here. Let's do it. We gotta be careful here. Hero what? circle. What are these? These are huge. Yeah man, this is our local land crab. People around the world know it as mud crab. We call it land crab. A mud crab, so you yeah. find us in the swamps. You find us in the swamps, they cross the roads. At this type of month when it's rainy season, they're out and about. And it's one of the delicacies. You see it, it's on the street side, you just stop, get one, get two. Beautiful. And we just open them up, it's a soup? Up. Yeah, it's spicy. It's spicy. It have scotch bonnet, pepper bonnet. Ooh. So yeah, man. Give me that scotch bonnet. It have scotch bonnet. The whole pot is just soaked with flavor. Ah, oh, I'm excited. Let's and go. Let's one of this. the main ingredients as well, Jamaica's most important spice, pimento. 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 I didn't know that. Yeah, that's what that's what makes our jerk jerk, and that's what makes the crab spicy with the scotch bonnet. So no pimento, no jerk. You want to taste it? Oh, if I, yes, please. All right, tell me. Mm, it is a little spicy. The only problem with crab, not enough meat. <laughs> so let's see this thing. Oh yeah. yeah so much flavor. You gonna crack it now? Crack it. Woo! Alice, how long have you been doing this? 20 years right here? More than 20. More than 20. More than 20. Look at all that meat. Beautiful claw. Mm hmm. We love the spice. Yeah, man, the spice level. So you just dipped it? Oh, she just dipped it. Made it spicy. In there. Yeah, man. Yeah. And so, yeah, that's what I was talking about. Mmm. The broth. The broth with that. Oh, scotch bonnet. Yeah, man. <coughs> yeah, man. Oh, that's good. So, this is how they do it. Just come here, get a few crabs. Get a few crabs, get some corn. Get some soup. Mm. You have you have coconut? Yeah. So right here is one of the few places you'll find in Jamaica where once you get the spice from that, mm -hmm. you get a roast corn and you get a dry coconut to eat with the roast corn. Because our corn isn't like sweet corn in America. So you have to add something to it to sweeten it. It's also a lot more tough. Oh. Oh, whoa. Look at that. Oh, the meatiness is open like that, just like that, and that's all you. That's you all me. You dip it. You dip it. Or dip it again, man. More spice. More. Double the heat. Double the flavor. Yeah, ready? Double the sweet. Spicy. Yeah, man. So we can't get Spicy crabs. Crabs. Fantastic. Well, one, one more big one. Oh, yeah, man. That was amazing. Sweet and spicy. Mmm. So much meat, almost like the stone crabs in Miami. Yeah. We have a crab here that's similar to the stone crab. Mm -hmm. I can suck on these crabs all day. When you pull, even if you don't get the meat, you get the flavor. You can literally sit here all day and just eat. That's beautiful. Not like a crab claw, with all that spice, all that seasoning and all that scotch bonnet pepper. It's beautiful. And this is the back? Yeah, the chest. The chest? This you just suck. Oh. <coughs> That's scotch bonnet. You gotta break it open? Whoa. 
Some, some good crabs, man. So my hands are dirty. So come right over here and wash up. Yeah, yeah. And that's clean water. Yeah. So we have some spice. Now we're gonna get something to cool it down, right? Yeah, man. You want beer? Beer. Yeah. <laughs> what beer do you have? We have cold beer. Cold beer, red stripe. I'm guessing. Yeah, red stripe. It's been a while. Red stripe is the national beer of Jamaica. Yeah. Yeah. yeah have a beer. Why not? The beer of Jamaica. The one thing that you have to try when the sun hot and the music sweet. This will make you move your feet. The good stuff. Mm, I love this. Red Stripe, classic bottle, a little dark, obviously that protects from the light. Oh, nothing like a cool lager to cool you down. Cheers, cheers. Roast corn go with the coconut. Also the boiled corn. So you got some corn and you have some roasted coconut. So the breadfruit is in there to thicken the soup up. It's not going to be served like a yam or like a potato in there. It's actually a thickening agent. Did you hear that you're having chicken foot, so you're having steppers. I like, I like chicken feet. That's a nice sprinter. <laughs> I think I'll take steppers. <laughs> I'll take steppers too. Yeah. Doesn't sound great. This is it. And then we serve it with what in the pot. That, that Those are like good. provisions. So they cook down. Yeah, man. So this is salt. So fish. oil down, oil down. Oil down, pretty much. Yeah, man. <laughs> More flavor. So it's salt fish, it's cucumber, it is onion, scotch bonnet, pepper, has to be in there. And wow. the salt fish itself, that is what you put on top. You lather it on to the yam and it, re it rehydrates the yam and adds that flavor, that saltiness, brings out more flavor in the yam. You ask about your seeing bolt. Yam is what sold out after you see in Bolt beat the world record because he's from the part of Jamaica where Trelawney, where yam is mostly come from, and yam is sold. And after that, they asked him why you run so fast. The yam from Trelawney. Wow! Yeah. So the yams what gives him the yams what the, gives the energy. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> it's amazing. Oh, that's the yam. Yes, that's a yellow yam. Oh, right there. Right there in the corner. In the corn husk. In the corn husk. Do I actually eat the corn husk? This is my plate. Yeah. Yes. Cucumber. Ooh, so hot. Yeah, it's hot. Careful. Spicy. Everything's gonna be spicy. I love it, man. In Jamaica, you come for the heat. It's fantastic. I've only had cucumber so far. Let me get into the salt fish. But what they do is they rehydrate it. So it has to go into water to soak to take some of that saltness off of it. Mm. Either that or they roast it as well and scrape it. Very salty, dense. Yeah, so once you put that on the dry roast there. Yeah? It tastes so nice. So it, it really just complements it. And it's spicy. For me, it's like a maybe a seven spice level. Yeah. I do spice. Yeah, yeah, it, it could. It's not like the pot. Drink that and you're good. Oh if you did have the purple oh. pepper in the nose, would I really Purple pepper? Taste? Don't give me that. <laughs> they, they told me it's a weary -we -we pepper? No, Grim Reaper. Oh, the Grim Reaper. Yeah, man. They said that spoils the pots. Oh, I, now I feel the heat because my eyes. It's starting like, to Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. <laughs> <laughs> I feel it now. Look at my there eyes, bro. Oh my God. <laughs> Sorry, you kill me. Kill me, kill I me. Kill you kill me! <laughs> like, I feel the heat. Scotch bunny pepper and everything here. Thank you so much. I'm gonna have it later with some yam. Okay, Dad. I won't lie. That was hot. That reminded me of pepper pot in Guyana. The heat. Add some coal into it to keep the fire so that it keeps bubbling and stuff. So that's why they actually take the crab out so that the crab doesn't overcook. So when she breaks it apart like that, that meat comes out flush. That's yeah. how you know a perfectly cooked crab. Amber is inside the tire, the yeah. rim. That is the way. You have a purple one? Purple! Don't and scare pepper, me. You can't manage them, You can't manage even do it with our hand. I'm nervous, I'm nervous. <laughs> that one is not even purple good. <laughs> that one not that purple. It's not no spoiled. Doesn't bad. matter the color. Yeah, Doesn't matter, bro. <laughs> <laughs> You're killing me! First year in Jamaica! I'm on fire! I didn't know it was this spicy! <laughs> yeah, he did that hunger. I might have masked I had a nibble. <laughs> no, you didn't get the seed or anything, but if you got the seed. No, or you die, you die. I know, bro. Yeah, I know these, these peppers are no joke. Oh, oh. No, man. I mean, respect, respect. Me give one yeah, Jamaica add pepper, so I'm gonna give my water. I'll forgive my water. <laughs> a water, water. This spice is no joke. 
and the Hello, coconut. Hello. Like this? Yeah, bite the corn. So you bite corn first? Anyone. Bite the coconut. Chew yeah. it up together. That's roast corn and coconut. Only when you come to Jamaica. Mm. You get the real stuff. It's just pure smokiness. <laughs> That's because that is the roast corn. Roast and the cold stuff. I like it because yeah. it, it's almost like a palate cleanser. From spice to this. Good. The heat's gone. I love the roasted coconut. It's so dense. The only thing missing is some butter. Thank you, respect. Bye guys, bye. Thank you so much. It was great. You're the best, you're the best. Too much. By the way, you don't have to do what we're doing, which is like actually standing here. You can just come with your car, grab the crabs, go home, go to the beach. Awesome. Yes. My girl Alice here, yes. the best. You ready, bro? Yeah, next PHN CM treatment, that's what we said. Yeah. On to the next step. Amazing. Yeah, Madine, Nadine, everything cooking curry. Yeah, everything cooking steam and curry. Um, bro, what's your name? I'm sorry. I'm Nicholas. Nicholas. Yeah. This is Kingston. Amazing. Just watch the camera. <laughs> Don't want to lose this one. This is what? Denham Town. Denham Town. So you in some places that the normal average tourist will not travel to. Unless I'm going to a party. <laughs> I ain't no average tourist. I always go deep, deep. So Matthew is telling me that this country, this island, has the most churches per square mile and the most bars? Most bars and most churches per square mile. And I can show you places where here's a church, to the left here's a bar, to the right here's a bar. They said to the left is for the congregation, to the right is for the pastor. No way. Yeah. <laughs> That's amazing. So Rastafarian is the primary religion? No, no. Christianity is the primary religion. Rastafarian is the latest religion to, that the world has recognized. I think the last recognized religion was Rastafarianism, wow. which started in Jamaica. And if you don't know, the reason why Bob Marley died is because he decided not to amputate because he's against the religion. And that's why we don't have Wait, Bob Marley. You didn't know that? No, what? Hell should be. Hell. Looks pretty dead right now, but Ooh, it's hot. Super scorching hot. You ready, bro? Yeah, man, ready. So remember, I was telling you that Jamaica was once a Spanish. In 1494, Columbus rediscovered Jamaica. So there's still Spanish influence in our food. We're going to try some fried lobster with escovitch sauce. Escovitch comes from escoviche. It's scotch bonnet pepper, pickled onions, and we just have to try it. Everything's gonna have scotch bonnet. I didn't know that. Yeah, it's gonna be have, great. We're, we're look, look, look at the view. Wow, what a view, huh, Nate? This is amazing. Look at that, we're in Jamaica. So besides Red Stripe, is there any other drink in Jamaica? Yeah, man. What do you got? Appleton. Appleton. Which is a red rum. We have white rum. White rum is the main thing. We have one that's called special as well, which is... Under the counter? Under the counter? No, oh, under, under the counter, counter you, you want what we call <laughs> John Crabati. John Crabati or water boat. Pepper shrimp. Can we eat that right here? Like you yeah. break it up? We have soft shell ones. These are the natural ones. And then we have what's more like crawfish. The crawfish now has basically taken over the rivers. So you can't find these that much anymore. These are not indigenous to Jamaica and are an invasive species. So we've been charged to eat them all. So it's like Miami, we have the iguanas. We're supposed to eat all the iguanas yeah. as fast as possible. Woo! So here it is. We are the land of wood and water in Jamaica. So you don't need land to farm this. You basically make your traps. You put fruit in there, coconut, anything, oranges, mango, and the, shrimps will, the, the shrimp will go in there, can't come out. You put them in some scotch bonnet, salt water. Some people add scallion, some people add onion, some people don't. Little but guys. you got a double. You, you, can't, got a double. you can't put that back. Get a double. Scotch bonnet pepper. That's so nice. Look at salt. Spice, pepper. Yeah, Look at heat, Look at sweet. Just like Jamaica. Nice swimmers. Yeah, man. Swimmers. Swimmers. <laughs> got it, got it. It was good. And after this, we chase it down with some rum? Yeah. And then you will need some more of this. To help settle the room. You know what to tell if somebody is drunk and driving in Jamaica? No. They drive straight, they're not dodging potholes. It's complete opposite than the US. <laughs> <laughs> That's, That's good stuff. <laughs> I'm ready. This you can get in time. No my line and that. Yeah man, that good. Oh that's good. <laughs> this uh this reminds me of like grappa or rakia. 
Cheers. Yeah, rakia. Yeah, it tastes like rakia. Cheers, cheers. cheers. Come on, salud. Yeah, man. So. Feeling lit, boy. Am, this, I, am this I saying is, it right? I'm trying this my best. This is also used as medicine. So if anybody go into the rain, people, the grandmothers, would just put it on your head top. Yeah, yeah of course. Like, put it in your hand. Throw it in your hand. And, your hand and just sap your, rub. Sap and if you Yeah, man. Yeah, yes, yes. Then yes. take a yeah, sleep out there like this. And then. Yeah. Last it. Yeah, man. <laughs> Yeah. You can't get sick after that. Whoa. And you, you feel cool now, right? You feel amazing. Cool you're yeah. Yeah, wow. Man. Yeah, of course. It's alcohol. Yeah. They say, alcohol. in the same thing they do in like Eastern Europe, they'll put this on kids that are sick in the shower, put yeah. a lot of rakia on them, and it yeah. takes away the sickness. Yeah. yeah, man. Hey, cheers, bro. Cheers. Cheers. Bro. cheers. And we need, some, uh, we need some more shrimp, right? Yeah, man. Can't pull no, them out. Yeah, just pour them out. Just, just pour, pour them out. out. Yeah, man. Hold your hand. See all the scotch bonnet pepper. Look at that. Out. Look at that. Piece of scotch bonnet on it. I'm gonna get a little bit too. Okay, uh, and then you have the scotch bonnet seed on that. Ooh, that's when you know it's hot. That's when you know it's spicy and nice. Mm. Get off the burn off of the rum. Mm hmm. Mm. Scotch bonnet. This will sober you up. This will sober you up. Yeah. The heat, the salt. I love the crunch. Yeah, that's how you know it's cooked well. A lot of places you might get it a little softer. Too soggy. Light fry on it. Put it out in the salt water, the scotch bonnet pepper, let that soak in and just let it sit. It's so nice. Pair it with some rum. Yeah, man. And you know them, sir. This is the second time we're having it. Once it's nice, you do it twice. That's how Jamaica is. Once it's nice, you do it twice. Yeah, man. <laughs> it's almost in Dominica when it's. No, no, not one kubi, two kubi, right? <laughs> all in. Yeah, man. Put all the chips on the table. Scotch bonnet pepper. <laughs> yeah. Don't leave the scotchy. Now I'm Jamaican, man. Well, when you finish that, I'm going, we're going to put the ceiling on it. Just down that one. You want to finish the Jamaican now? Hold on. See the Jamaican thing now, you have And take all the juice. Oh, yeah, man. Everything. That. everything. That's how you clean your hands. Yeah, man. Everything. <laughs> mm, mm. Everything. This is. Huge ones, they're not as sweet as the small ones. So because we'll put they're these. They're not Jamaican. They're not Jamaican. That's why they're not as sweet. <laughs> so when the rum hits you, or the, 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 the spice hits you, or the scotch bonnet hits you, there's only one thing you can say Bumbo clot. Bumbo clot. You do it too good. <laughs> Bumbo clot. I'm from Miami, got that Caribbean feel already, man. <laughs> Yeah, man. Bob McClud. <laughs> you, you know, I learned so much drinking just by hearing Bob Marley. Yeah. Just by hearing Bob Marley, you start to understand the patois. Absolutely. Yeah, man. Yeah. Oh. This is Great. his spot right yeah, here. So right that's here. what I'm saying. It's amazing. Yeah, man. See, see his son on, that's his son right there. Yeah, oh, that's his son? Yeah. Which one? That's Junior Gang. That's yeah. Damien. That's, that's yeah. my, yeah. one of my favorite man. So behind us, we have the Blue Mountains. This is yeah, where man. the best coffee in the Caribbean, disputably in the world, yeah. comes from. Right over there. Blue Mountains. The highest range in Jamaica as well, at 10,000 something feet above sea level. Highest range in Jamaica right there, 10,000 feet above sea level. And I love this, people are in the water. So I just take my shirt off, do I go in there? Now I'm enjoying the rum. Welcome to Jam Rock. Yeah, man. Welcome to Yad. So there's 14 parishes, which are like Four, states. Yeah, 14 parishes, three counties. Three counties. So it's divided in three and then yeah. 14. Cornwall, Middlesex, sorry, and 14 around. It, I mean, nobody even counts the, the, the different um, the, the counties anymore. We, people, you barely hear people talk about it anymore. It's just the parishes. Got which, it. It's still one. Got some crafts here. Let's go shopping. Crafts some those shells. That's what we call widdicks. Whoa. And look at that beauty. Yeah, uh, that how much for one of these? $12 US? No, this is awesome. Look, you put yeah, this on the table. It's so smooth and then so rugged on top. What a great gift. Yeah. 15? That is a conch shell. No, but that, I've never seen one like this with this like yeah, tiger this stripes. This is the helmet. The helmet. Oh All right, so let's do something at the end. We'll come back to you and see what you got. Yeah, man. It's a, this is the bowl and the food that, that yeah. Rasta you thought of. It's made out of calabash. Rasta para, you know? Our boy Matthew is famous. This guy walks around everywhere in Jamaica and they're like, What up, bro? Matthew! Love your stuff, the boss. Jamaican food boss, bro. Yes. Next up, we're going to Aunt Miro. I'm trying to adapt my accent. I'm trying, trying. Yeah, bro. Respect. Respect. Jamaican chocolate. Come to eat some wraps. Hello. 
Yeah. So that's the pirate fish, and this is a red snapper. So in Spanish, we call it pargo. 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 He's in right on the water. Your place is great. And your your name is Aunt Mira? Aunt Mira. How long have you been here? No, my dad, you know, Aunt Mira. Oh. 50 years old. 50 years old? Yeah. Woo! What are you guys doing here? Let's see. Good work, you know? Snapper. Yeah, snapper, you know? What do you want? What do you want? I think we should do two massive ones. The eyes never lie. Yeah. You have to check the eyes. Yeah, if they're like hazy. No, no they're easier to fall in. So you see how it's clear? And you see that they have the festival in there, which is something that has to go with it. What's a festival? Festival is, think of a corn dog without the dog inside. So it's a little sweet. It's basically more dough. Yeah, it's fried bread. <laughs> doubles, doubles, doubles. Yeah, man. It's, it's like pilori. This one has a, it's a big one. Con, it's a little sweeter though. It's sweeter and yeah. it's long. So it's like it's a big mixed, stick. Right. Some people add the sugar, you have the baking powder and you have cornmeal in there with all purpose flour. So it swells up, pops up, it's real crunchy, little sweet to take off the heat. And it's really hot, so let's get out of here. Oh my god. How do you how do you live in here, man? I used to, you know? You used to live in here. Many years, many years You're not even sweating. I used to eat dinner. Cool like a cucumber. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I choose it. Cool as a cucumber. Here is this escabiche. Escabiche. Pickled. Yeah. I can't anymore. How do you feel? Thousand degrees? Fire blaze. <laughs> Woo! Fire blaze in her. Dying. The type of wood that they use is a different type. You say you like Bob Marley? Yeah. You ever hear when he said love wood burning through the night? Love wood yeah. burning. Love wood burning through yeah. the night. Our man here with a billion pepper shrimp. Pepper swimmers. Loading up some more. Yeah, man. Wow. This is the nicest snack I've ever had, man. Salty, spicy, peppery, everything. Wow, the smell is amazing. Scotch bonnet, pepper, little onion. Yes, right there. Wow. That's bucket of flavor or like a bucket of spice. It's like roses. It's like harmony to me. All of this. So good. Yeah, man. So good. That is it. Ganja wine, we have iron crab roots, we have moringa roots, See the roots that we're juice. talking about. Mm -hmm. Non alcohol, non sugar roots, we have ganja wine, we have the noni juice also, non alcohol, non sugar roots, fix up your structure, build back your immune system, restrain your whole entire body. Restrain my whole body? Yeah. A shot? Yes, just a shot. Build back your immune system. I'm Ras Andy. A real Rasta man. Big up Rasta. With a real Big roots up. medicine. You yeah, know? man. Bless up yourself. True man. Jamaica. Yes. From Green Hill, West Milan. My place yeah. on the sun. So I, I'm just mesmerized by the Green food. Right? Before you pass school the town. Yes, I'll go across. Yes, so uh, we can try something here? Yeah, Jamaica is nice, you know. You can. This is a sex marathon. Ganja wine. Rebuild back your immune system. But will it make you high? Fix back your body. Fix back your body. This fix gets you high? Yes. Will it make you high? Yes, if you drink too much at one time. What's that? Make you high. Not wrong. Uh, can we have a shot? It's recommended you have a shot. Go with a shot. One yes. shot. My turn to try the festival. Yes, yes. Mm. Yes. Nice. It's a funnel cake. This needs honey though. Need honey honey. Mm hmm. Dry like that for the little scotch on it, pepper. Look like this. Come here. Cheek up here. Yeah. Make it spicy. A spicy sweet funnel cake. We'll try this again and the, the texture will be different the next time. It'll be a little tougher, but that goes well with jerk as well. We're going the small one because I'm the only one drinking here today. So you want me to shot it? Yes. You can look at that to your man, might as well. You too? Yeah, yeah. But we don't want enough. Right? Come on man, we're trying to Alright, there we go. Whoa, it smells like a bitter. That's what it is. It's pure bitter? Yeah, yeah a little bit, a little bit, a little sweet, a little healthy. Yeah. 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 A, lot, a lot of chronic in here, though. Very sweet. There's peanuts in there. There's peanuts in it. Yes, wrap it. Short the peanuts though. And then it's all nice. <laughs> wow. He buries this for three years? Three years before it comes up. Three years, and this is six years buried away. Six years? Yes. Fermented. That's why, that's why I said to him, I want to hear the psh. Right. Uh, fried snapper. Yes. Grab some meat. Yes. Put on top of the cassava bread. Cassava. Bami. Bami. Yes. And you get the escuviche. Yeah. Right. With that. 
seasoning. Ooh, and you throw some There's spice on top. Pepper. Right. Some and scotch bonnet. And onion. Oh, yeah, man. Slash that. Bless it, love. Real. Natural. Natural? Amazing. Sex marathon, ganja wine, me have. Non alcohol, non sugar roots. Health power, real power. So before we go to the next stop, I'm gonna finish this. It's good. It's an acquired taste. Yeah, so the star, David, it is what the Rasta, it's also a Rastafarian symbol. It's huge in the Rastafarian culture for them to have that. They wear it and they basically use it as part of the symbols of Rastafarianism as well. So this area is made up of small restaurants. The best ones to go to are the ones we're going to. Obviously, the best view, best food. Definitely come to this guy and buy some crafts. I'm gonna buy that later. I think it's amazing, 15 US dollars. It's a great gift, that one. One of these is nice. Five, how much is five? How much? So if me give you what? You can give you what? $40 US? I'm taking this home to my future house. So we're back here at Screechies yeah, and we're gonna make some Screech lobster. International. We're gonna get some lobster now. Eat a fried or got it, but we're heading back. You know? Yeah, man. Whoa. When you know, you know. That's a small door, I didn't know. <laughs> So these are spiny lobsters. Yes, spiny lobsters is what we get in the, in Jamaica, nothing else. Yeah, in the Caribbean, this is what we get in warm yes, water. This is, it. this is what we get in Miami too. Yep. Any season, our full season, oh, Miami, one of the best times in Miami. Best time. Man. So these four are good for you. Today? Yeah. Yeah, fresh. Yeah, fresh caught. Oh, they they go already. like in the night. Oh, in the night time. Oh, yeah. Wow. So in the morning when they come now, then we get the fresh catch. Gotcha. So you're just shoving off. Yeah. All the hands? All the feet, yeah. All the feet. Depends who you're asking, it's either hands or feet with this one. So right now he's cleaning the lobster and he's taking out the brain. It's the one piece they don't eat. Some other places on the island, they'll mix it with their curry to make it a nice flavorful curry. But here they just throw it away. So once he cleans it, then we're going to throw it on the grill, right? This looks good. Yeah, that's a steamed fish right here. That's steamed fish? Yeah. So you're telling me that's not a fry, Jack? I'm joking, I'm joking. It's, 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 it. it's a Belize joke, it's a Belize joke. It's, it's like a two inch layer of oil, then he has huge pargo. We also have the Jamaican festival. Yeah. Sweet dough. Sweet dough. The best. The best. The In best. The culture, right now. Okay. Right now. Can't wait. Can't and, wait to taste it. And over here we're going to do the lobster. Yeah. We're going to do the lobster over there. Over there. Over right here. We're going to fry the lobsters and stuff. Yeah, yeah. So when time we light up the fire and get the Let's eye eating, we're gonna I'm making one for myself. For yourself? Yeah, so it's not, not yeah, that's different. It. <laughs> it's not our original making one, it's a personal one. Gunshot! Oh. <laughs> that was scary. It started to pop. <laughs> no, alright. Listen with the spine up says now. Listen when they drop them in the hot eye. And give off that and that's why I cut off the claws. So all of these that you see, those are the, the two that pop. You make the eye splash, you know? Yep. So you kind of get rid of them so you don't get that enough splash. That's like the that. moisture inside the lobster. So it's not the water. Yeah. So he's going to let, let it fry for 15 minutes. After that, he'll flip it for 15 more minutes, and then we're ready to eat. Yeah. This is the Jamaican festival. It's the best. The best. Yes. All right, we're going to make them fry on the shell for it now for another 15 minutes. So the other side, which is in the shell, can get the fry also. I got like flour, sugar, and the regular ingredients. I would not speak, but the regular ingredients. Homemade, basically, squeegees production. So we do it like this. Get it like that. Then we do it like this. Spread it out with the fingers so we can get it to sweat. So we're gonna put it in our eye. So meanwhile it's frying, it's gonna take time and rise out the oil. So when it's well, you see that perfection of it. So you just spin it and then you get it right. You know? That's what we're talking about, some Jamaican lobsters. <sighs> so hot in here, let me get out of here. So right here we have the garlic, garlic lobster. lobster. Looks amazing. And this is your Escovich lobster. So that's Escovich, that's yeah. pickled onions pickled and scotch onions, bonnet. Scotch bonnet, pepper, pimento. Wow. And you had to make 12 of these festivals. Oh my gosh, these are the best. There's the calories for the week, man. Right yeah. there. Right yeah. there. Yeah. 
For this one, we're doing this, man. Are hitting up the hot sauce? Yes, we're doing the hot sauce, right here. So we'll figure out how we do it, maybe with one of these festivals. It's all right, man. Let me show you how we do this. Oh, you're going to do like that? Far, I can hold it with your hand. Yeah, yeah. Just like yeah. that. Well, we ain't going with the fork, though. We're going with the we're fork. We're just picking you up with it. If you don't want to go in with the fork, you can do it, it like you know, it is the Caribbean. Got it. And it's a simple twist yeah. and turn. Yeah. And everything and should come on. Yeah. Come on, I'll get every seat here. Yeah, one pull. You right should now. get one pull. Everything should be out. Yes. Um, with the escaviche? Cheers. 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 Yeah, man. Mm. Spicy. Mm -hmm. You've like been saying that a lot. <laughs> no, but you know, because I didn't expect all this level of heat. Yeah. Smoky. Ooh, the crack. Oh, here the crack. Look, there's right still meat in there. Shell. Yeah, man. Still a lot of meat in here. You, my friend, know how to eat lobster. Bro, I'm Caribbean. Lobster. Being in lobster my whole life. Spiny lobster, too. Mm hmm. Spiny lobster. Even though I love. The like the main the lobster. Main lobster? It's the good. Cup? Yeah, yeah, of course. But this is this is different. Mm -hmm. Unique flavor. Mm. With the end, seaweed right there. Yeah. Like sea water. Yeah, man. You guys have sea moss here in Jamaica? Yeah, we do. Oh. Irish moss is what we call it. Popular Rasta drink. Yeah man. I need it. <laughs> <laughs> is that it? Killed it. One bite, one kill. This is Whoa. what most people come here for. For this? The fried lobster. It's amazing lobster. Yeah. Fried lobster, Helsha Beach on a whole, that's what it's known for. So the fish wow. is amazing, the festival is amazing, but the fried lobster, them say it's something with the oil. That's the only. That's the only logical explanation that we have. And this is the other reason they come here. That is it. For the festival. We're doing this. Are we bringing in some pepper sauce? Oh, we're bringing sauce? in some pepper sauce. Yeah, man, right away we need to bring in the heat. I can't even open it right now. My hands are too lobster. <laughs> it's like slimy. My first touch of the pepper sauce, and I can't wait to try this. Oh, crap. Mm. Oh, it you pairs put, perfectly. That's not everything. Mm hmm. Mm -mm. Of course. It's really that good. I'm not even going to, trust me, perfect with this. I love it. Nice, sweet wow. dough. With that wow. pairing, because that comes sweet and yeah, spice. Mm. <laughs> that hits the spark. I know, <laughs> it definitely does. Oh yeah. It's a garlic sauce? Yeah, it's a nice garlic sauce. I'm missing the garlic yeah, lobster. Man. Get in there, David. Let me see how you leave with the garlic. Let me see, let me see. I'm trying. Oh, that's spines though. Let's just pull this guy out. Is that peppercorn on top? Yeah, that's pe that's pimento or pepper. Pimento. That's how you commit. Mmm. Garlic. So buttery. Yeah, this is this is better than that's gonna be true. In my personal opinion. Oh wow. Can I crack it open? That's how you know. You know how to eat lobster. That's how you know if you eat lobster. You know if you deal with it as we'd say in Jamaica. Mm. Oh wow. Good stuff, man. Yeah, man. So you told me that you um, you have a bottomless pit. Yeah, pretty much. Can I, I... No, no. <laughs> <laughs> That was an incredible seafood day here in Kingston. My man, thank you so much. Yeah, man, respect, man. It's been awesome. It's got the bill for the lobsters. It's like 105 US. Yeah. And then before that, the, the snapper was like 80. Yeah, 18, 18, 90 dollars. So easily spent like $250 today just to eat all the seafood, but it's yeah, seafood, super fresh, but just understand Jamaica is not a cheap country. No, Jamaica not cheap at all. Not cheap. Yeah. So come with the Benjamins, man. <laughs> Straight up, right now, get, get, me a, get me a million views. Let me pay back this, this bill. <laughs> Tell me about it, doing food videos here? It's like hundred dollars, but you don't even break even with the video. Bam. The one thing you have to know about Jamaica is everything here is on island time. Yeah, man.
Jamaica no problem. <laughs> <laughs> Mean that nothing is a problem. You better relax and iry. The reason why I came here, I knew about oh, really? this place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks, man. I'm from New York. Oh yeah? The reason why I came here. Came Amazing. Place, yeah, yeah, for man. sure. Yeah, yeah. Peace, nice to meet you. Thanks a lot, man. Nice to meet you. Your name? Oh, Nashi. And uh, New York, that's my biggest fan base. To my guy in these. Surinamese. Dominican. <laughs> Your favorite Star Wars character? Chewbacca. Chewbacca? I'm going with Chewie. Okay, okay. Chewie's the man. He don't have to say much, but he gets the job done. Uh, for me, it's like R2-D2, bro. Just... Huh? <laughs> well, he's the he's the <laughs> thanks, bro. Sure, thanks. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Let's do it. Let's do it. I said it because I saw the Star Wars. <laughs> Alright, photo. Let's go. Yeah, man. This place is actually great. Small. All locals. There's a few different restaurants, some Rastas, Where's and chill, restaurant? man. Chill. Peace, bro. Gun history 1494, Columbus came, saw the Arawaks, Indians, or what they now say, the Tainos. After that, you had until 1494 till the 1600s were under Spanish rule, which is why Spanish Town was the capital of Jamaica. Then the English came in the 1600s, and until from the 1600s until 1962, Jamaica gained their independence. Then most of the crops that the English did was sugarcane, and basically traded from here. Not only sugarcane, but logwood, that wood that's burnt. That is one of the woods that made them come here, known as the rich wood. We used to send that down the river and sell it back to England for dye. But that's basically the history in a nutshell. Did I do one minute? The British do the same thing in every country down here. So it's got the logs, they got the logs. They need all that lumber. They didn't even use the lumber for lumber only, they use it for dye. So logwood is a red condensation in there that could make um, red dye number one, I believe it's called. And it basically made dyes for them. We're leaving the area of Port Moore, which is the second largest city in Jamaica after Kingston. It's right here. It's like a 25 minute drive, very close. And we're hoping we see some vendors on the street, you know, coconut water, some fruits, something, even some Jamaican patties, right? Yeah, I'm all about the Jamaican patties. Right, yeah, right, 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 right. In one, what is it, only a couple hours? Where's my bag? I, I'm cutting the rights. No more rights. So we're here at my Airbnb. Uh, it's an amazing place here on the sixth floor. So we got a penthouse. It's gonna be awesome. So right here, sign. And what else? His name? Yeah, his name is Nate. Yeah. You have to just sign here. Oh, here. Just stay there, bro. Stay there. Fairly easy, man. Mm. Make, it, make it easy, you know? Make it yeah, easy, make it, man. easy, man. We're on island time. It's not too complicated, you know? <laughs> And simple for everybody. Simple. Perfect. Yeah, true, true. So sixth floor, just go up? Yeah. It's a nice place, right? Yeah, man. Nice place. Nice place. <laughs> Respect. Let's go, guys. Let's do this. No, I know, man. It's been, it's been a long drive. I'm taking this home, man. We uh, travel heavy. I'll see you tomorrow. Yeah, man. Another light. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Jamaica, we have a bobsled team. <laughs> Nate. Not this one, You ready for the sixth floor? Let's go. Ben house, baby. I'm doing, I'm doing Casey style. Do some Casey shots. I feel like you'd have to have like the camera like here looking as you. It was great. Let's open this up. You know how much I love my Airbnbs, and this is my penthouse here in Kingston. Huge space. We got a loft. So as you enter, you have big couch, TV. Over here, we have the kitchen. Got everything, all the amenities. Fridge, microwave, oven. And over here, we have so washer and dryer. What else we got here? <laughs> over here, we have the guest bathroom. Nice, small, of course, for guests, no shower. Over here, this is what sold me in the beginning when I saw the photos on Airbnb. I was like, wow, this is awesome. Got the view. Epic view. Oh my God, what was that? Oh, the, the wind upstairs. <laughs> Too much. And one of the great things about um, this apartment is that we have air conditioning. We have Wi-Fi. We're in a safe building. We got security. Let me go upstairs. Nice hardwood floor. And then in here we have two rooms and they're mirrored rooms. So me and Nate can choose either one. Exactly the same. 
So that's one room with TV. So mine doesn't have TV, but I'm good. I have a phone if I need it. We have a closet. So big closet. You can open this up if you need some more air. Like that. And then I think with this bathroom over here. I think so. <laughs> it's the wind, bro. It's the wind. And then over here we have the bathroom. So here we have storage space. We can put our bags in here if we want. Open it up. And this is the shower. So it's nice. It's a decent place, uh, affordable. I think I spent like 150 a night and you know, it was really hard to find Airbnbs with two bedrooms with two beds. And it's a great spot. I think it's awesome. It was a long day today. I'm extremely tired. I woke up five in the morning. I flew only one hour from Miami to Kingston. Came here, went on a nonstop seafood tour. And that's basically it. It's 6.30. I am tired. Tomorrow we're gonna start fresh. And I'll see you in the morning. I'll see you guys mañana. Good morning. Welcome to Jamrock. What people, dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Second day here in Kingston and we're meeting right now with the Jamaican food boss, Matthew. We're going on an incredible tour today. It's gonna be epic. I can't wait. Let's go, let's go. Oh, six floors, elevator. Yeah. This has been a great ride, but I need my coffee. We're five minutes from the spot. Yeah. I can't wait. It's been like a snake, like weaving through these turns, super tight, lots of bush everywhere, but the views get better and better the higher we go. Wow, that's Kingston way over there. It's amazing. I'm here in the Blue Mountains in Jamaica, and I'm eating the national dish of Jamaica, ackee and saltfish for the first time. Jamaican foods in the Blue Mountains, let's go. What are you getting? Espresso? No, I'm getting a cappuccino or just some raw Blue Mountain coffee. Raw Blue Mountain yeah. coffee. What does that entail? Hello. Black. Hey, how you guys doing? Morning. I love your space. This is great. So what do you guys have? Bagels and croissants. So they got the breakfast, but we need coffee. Thank you. We need coffee right now. Blue Chino. Look at that. So what do you want to do? So what's your recommendation for me? A cold. Cold? Yeah. Blue Chino. Blue Chino? Yeah. Which is Blue Chino? Let me see it. I'll do that. Blue Chino. You? I'm going cappuccino. And you? Um, and I'll just take a large iced coffee. So Cafe Blue produces their own coffee. Yeah. They also have chocolate. They have some sweets. Over here you can buy coffee from their farm. You have Marley Farm as well, which is Bob Marley's children that have a blue, uh, coffee in the Blue Mountain. No way, I didn't know that. Yeah, man. But we're here to promote Cafe Blue. What's your favorite chocolate? I'm a big dark chocolate guy. Cashew and sea salt. My favorite one is sea salt. I like this one. And the second favorite one that people like is the Blue Mountain Coffee. Well, I will one, be taking them too. This one turn. I've been in a lot of cafeteras like this. So I'm from Miami, I've been to a lot of Cuban coffee spots. A lot of places like this, just making coffee. Getting nervous, you're getting nervous. By the way, I love the terrace. Incredible, the, the space inside is so small and you come out here and you're like, wow. Yeah, on the edge, one of these spots. Hello. Morning, morning. morning. how's everything? Good morning. My man, you ready? Yeah, man. Ready for some Blue Mountain Jamaican coffee? I can't wait. Mm. I hit the spot. It's like a frappe. Yeah, it's like you're going to chug it. Mmm, so good. I love that they put um, the whipped cream on top. Cinnamon. Oh, wow. I'm going to also try it just regular, like That's how good. Nate got it. Yeah. But this, this is nice. This yeah, is like a slushy. This is actually the best iced coffee of my life. Thank you so See much. That? I've, you've been saying that a lot in Jamaica. Dude, what, what do you mean? How many times have I said it? I haven't said it that many times. I, I never get ice. I get just cold brew now. Yeah. But like for me, frappe like in Greece. Yeah, me too. Yeah. This, this, I usually get a cappuccino. So right next door, we got the restaurant and we have some juices. Yeah, we have juices. Natural juices. Natural juices? So I think we should try uh, two different ones. Let's leave a cup of water and we'll yeah. try those two. Yeah, man. And here we go, the national dish yeah, of Jamaica. Incredible. So it looks like you said, it looks like scrambled eggs, but it's not scrambled Definitely eggs. Definitely not scrambled eggs. Totally different, totally more flavorful, totally wow. more unique. It's a massive plate. Yeah, In there's the ackee, the saltfish, then on the sides we have the plantain. Over here, this is another plantain, like... No, that is a dumpling, a boiled that's dumpling. A, that's a so dumpling. That's just flour that's been mixed up and boiled. Yeah, it's not scrambled eggs. So no, this is fruit with saltfish. This is fruit, but it's bit, you can taste the... the that it's been sauteed with onions, little garlic. So it's been with 
also scotch bonnet pepper. You see yours mm -hmm. peeping out right there on the side? So all of that has been spiced up onto it with a little onions, Ooh. not onions, sorry, scallion and thing in there. So it adds flavor to it as well. So it's not bland at all. And it has a sweet condensation. Nice oily, a little fluffy too. Yeah, man. As you said, you can actually make it into almost like a, a butter, not a jam really, but into a paste to put it on stuff as well. Like on toast? Yeah, on toast. It's a unique flavor profile. Yeah, man. The saltfish, the, and you would think that's eggs? That's not eggs. Mm -mm, that is aki. Come bring out the Jamaican accent, man. Aki. Aki. Yeah, man. Aki. Aki. Looks more like beef jerky. Yeah, this one, what happened is they fry it down. So it's corned at first and then they fry it down. Together? Or you can try it by myself. Sweet and savory. Sweet savory? Yeah, man. A little bit of fat in there? Yep. It's like bacon. It is. It's like Jamaican bacon. Mm, the best bacon. Whoa. This is like the best bacon, dude. Yeah, man. It, it totally... It's sweet. It's sweet, but it still has that saltiness from the corn, the corn wow. process. Look at that. You know the wheels on the push cart? That's how big we like the dumplings. So we call like it that massive? Like that massive wheel on it. I mean, they're dense. We like, it, yeah, man. when you pick it up, dumpling. look at this. So dense. You know how many uh, countries have dumpling as their national dish? Yeah, man. It's like 50, bro. Yeah. Asia as well have a lot. Mm-hmm. A lot. This is a flour dumpling. Flour dumpling. Straight flour dumpling. So I've had two different variations in a lot of countries in like Ukraine. Yeah. Yeah, so they'll have the whole wheat ones and then they'll have the regular flour. Same thing in Bhutan, a lot of dumplings. I guess everybody is pretty much the same, and I tell people all the time, that mm -hmm. just because it's different doesn't mean it's wrong. We just have exactly. different, yeah. Different influences. That's it. Some juices, and then we'll throw on sure, some yeah. sauce. So what juices do we this have? This is a pine and ginger juice. So pineapple with ginger in there. Jamaica is known for the potency of the ginger. We grow some of the best ginger in the world. Wow. Yeah, man. It's amazing. Intense, right? So the ginger beer I had last night. Yeah, ginger beer. It, that did have a whole heap of ginger, I'm sure. So refreshing. Wow. So pungent. It hits you, that yeah, ginger. Man. Now we're going to... David's been here. You want some? I don't know this. Let's try it with the Aki. Usually we don't... Mix? Actually, you're right, you know, because... Don't worry. I mean, this is David's been here exception. I thought about my viewers for Jamaica. Uh, <laughs> you, you, they don't put this. Uh, um, they don't put anything liquid, on? Liquid sauce on Aki. Oh, okay. This is a national dish. The only thing that you add to it is salt fish. It's so salt I, so I'm not supposed to do that? No. I, uh, do it. It mean, I mean, it don't matter. You can do it. It's I just, mean, it's my it's sauce. Let me try it. Can we? Yeah. I mean, so yeah, you're not supposed to mix any sauces with this. Scotch bonnet pepper is what you really go with it. I mean, my sauce makes everything better. <laughs> I mean, it was already amazing. I love that it's completely different from other places in the Caribbean. Most places, it's like salt fish, but like almost bland. Yeah. You no, know, this is a very different, unique experience. Yeah, this helps to flavor the ackee as well because you're not the ackee really doesn't have much salt. It has flavor, but the salt fish itself no need to add any extra yeah, salt or seasoning to it. Slow down with the dumplings. For sure. Hmm. I'll tell you, the food's awesome, but the view can't be yeah. beat. That's what I said. Might as well we come here and come explore the mountains, get some national dish, get some coffee up in the Blue Mountains. This dumpling is like concrete in your stomach. <laughs> Hits you like a brick. <laughs> I'll have one. Today's a long day. The juice is great though. Fresh juice. Thanks again. Let's go. All right, that was awesome. Good coffee, amazing food. I'm super full. So we're making our way back down the mountain yeah, now. Back down into, Kingston, no? into Kingston. Yeah, on the way, there's a lot of small like rum shops. Hopefully we find a coconut vendor. He was saying there's a, there's a Jelly Ninja, but he's in Montego Bay, which I'm, a, I'm very sad about because it's a three hour drive, but it's okay. Let's get on the road. Oh, dude, I'm full. I don't know how I'm gonna keep eating, but I'll try. That's the dumpling. I'll try the, yeah, the dumpling. It's the brick. Going down is quick, but after that food, <laughs> that was heavy. That was heavy. That was oh, I'm getting like a little car sick. Surprise, surprise. Spicy doubles? I think we can find it. Is that what we're get, getting? Yep. We're looking for it. Trini doubles in Jamaica? But spicy. Spicy doubles? Trini? Yeah? Alright, spicy doubles. That's gonna be great. 
He told me we're gonna have a lot of good, unique breakfast this morning, so adding Trini to the mix, doubles king right here. Yeah, Who's yeah. making the spicy doubles? Who's making it? Me? You making the spicy doubles? Yeah, we are making super spicy, but I'm not involved, but we are the cook inside. Yeah, man. Okay? All right. So welcome to super spicy doubles. Thank you. Okay? Thank you. So, this is pepper roti. Oh, we are also going to make a meat. Yeah, meat pepper roti. You need pepper roti? Yes. You need yes. pepper roti? Yes, yes. We're doing meat pepper roti. Curry chicken. Yes. Curry goat. Give me pepperoni. Woo! Are you using some shrimp and stuff too? Yes, we have shrimp. This is the shrimp. What is this right here? This is curry goat. Curry goat as yes. well? Yes, 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 yes. yes. And this is curry chicken. The beef is on the fire. I've had doubles in New York, Trinidad, where else? Florida, Grenada, Barbados. I've had basically doubles everywhere. Yeah. But now in Jamaica. That's your chana? Yes. How about your pepper? Spicy? Yes, yes, very spicy. So you got chana, okay. then we also have some other chutneys that go on top. Yeah, this is potato. Mm -hmm. Potato and chickpeas this. This is the potato and chickpeas. And this is the... More chana. Yes, this is the chana goes with the doubles. This is the one that goes on doubles? So that yes. one has potatoes, this one doesn't. Yeah, this is for the doubles. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Some vegetables. This is what's gonna go on top. Bacon shark. Oh, the bacon shark. You guys do bacon shark here as well? Oh my gosh. No, they don't have no bake. But this is the shark right here. Fried shark. Fish, not shark. Oh, you said shark. Traditionally, doubles is a veggie or a vegan dish. But you can add some meat if you want. Here they're adding some chicken. Yes, anything you want, What? What's your favorite? Shrimp, adding shrimp onto the doubles. Mm -hmm. Me too, actually. Yeah, yeah, we had it. Me too. I had that where? In Tabanka. Uh, in Tabanka. Yeah, Tabanka. Tabanka yes. or at Joyce. Looks like bus up shop. Yes, yes. So that's the bacon shark. Yeah. Looks really tasty, but I'm going with doubles. It's breakfast time. How many bara can you eat? One sitting. I do five, six. Easy. I can do ten. Ten? Yes. Whoa. Ten doubles. Ten doubles. Yeah, but I eat twenty before. <gasps> yeah, and my stomach was like it's filled. Oh. So I cannot manage. Can't. No, no more, no more. No, I did uh when I was in Port of Spain in Trinidad, mm -hmm. I did five double spots like you guys, five in a row. Okay. And then I had double, 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 and triple. Okay. I was okay. crazy. Yes. <laughs> They got pepper roti, they have dal puri, but they also have the doubles. But here they make them a little different. You can add meat if you want, that's more gourmet doubles. In Trinidad, that's a little bit of a sin, but I've tried it in Trinidad like that as well with some duck curry on top. Whoa, that was so good. And here, what do you guys have? You have chicken, you have beef, you have pork as well. So, no pork? Sorry, I had pork this morning, so I'm asking. And shrimp too? Yeah, we have shrimp. Curry shrimp, curry fish, curry beef, curry chicken. And you're gonna add all that on top of a double. Okay, I might just do the shrimp. Let's see. Or I go plain, like natural. Yes. Like regular. The vegan style. Ooh, I'm hot. I have to get out of this kitchen. Sorry. It is hot. I'm sweltering right now. You need to step out and step back. Oh gosh. Like the sunscreen is falling off my body. Alright guys, so we're going with doubles. We're actually gonna do a little twist here. They have regular doubles vegan style or veggie style but we're gonna go with goat curry so i'm gonna put goat curry on mine okay he's gonna put goat curry as curry goat oh <laughs> sorry sorry <laughs> I, no, no, we, were, we were having a debate about that curry goat so two curry goats and one curry shrimp correct doubles yeah yeah of course doubles and that's it for the shrimp one and no pepper the other two yes how spicy are these doubles? Uh, the pepper is spicy if you add the pepper to it. Hot Very spicy. Because the boss make it and she's Trinidad again. Perfect. Yeah, pe Trini pepper, the best. Scotch bonnet, scorpion, yeah. bring me all the peppers. Right here, super spicy. Let's eat. What is your name? David. David. How about you? My name is Clovet. Clovet. Yes, and Michaela. Michaela. How yes. you doing, Michaela? Michelle? Yes, yeah, my girlfriend. <laughs> my girlfriend? Yes. You oh snap, it. my girlfriend already. So his, no, no spice. That is mango. Mango chutney. Yes, that is tamarind. Glass of palm water. Cran grape? Yeah. Like cranberry. Yeah. Oh, so refreshing in this heat. Yeah. Thank you so much. 
Add it to my bill. So, I'll see you now. I'll see you now. See you guys, okay? I'll see you right now. Go curry doubles. Curry goods. Curry goods. Curry goods. Damn. <laughs> so they always give it to you like this in the small bag. This is to go. Look at this. Yes. No problem. No problem. No problem. Wow. That's gorgeous. The goat is there. So do you know how to eat this? You show me. I show you? It has the most, you don't use it. You grab the other one and you grab it on top. Yeah, so some people think I'm doing it wrong. Well, I was told that wh whichever one has, the bar that has the most stuff on top, yeah. that one stays there. Then you grab this one, the bottom one, the one that- That has the least. That has the least. Right. And then with it- You fold it and make it into almost like a patty. Well, you don't, so it's not the whole thing. No, you, you get one. You get one little piece and then use it to- Oh, oh no, like this, like this, like this. Just the whole thing. It's not even coming out. The, okay, no? So the whole thing, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. There Just like that. Right. Are you ready? Right. This, is gonna, this is gonna be epic. Yeah, this is gonna be epic. Mm. Love the sweetness and the spice. I, I was just about to say, the spice in there is really nice. I'm bringing out more flavors also to the wood. Yeah. Mine fell apart right away. Mm -hmm. And it's a nice fluffy butter. Yeah. How authentic is this, the Trini? I mean, besides the, the goat, it's pure. Yeah, I forget that Jamaican twist. With I know. <laughs> well, there was one thing we're missing. They don't have Shadow Benny. They ran out. They said it's right, hard to they, come by. I thought they had some in there. They probably finished it right when we got They there. finished it. So they only had mango chutney, pineapple chutney. Mm -hmm. No, no, tamarind chutney. Tamarind. So mango and tamarind. Yeah. And then they add just the chana. Mm -hmm. And that's it. So if you want to make this a little better, we have to add this guy. What do you think? David's been here? What do you think? Come on. Mine's falling apart. Oh, I just put them aside for you. Come on, touch it up. Zach, with chickpeas? China. Yeah, man. That's an amazing breakfast. I feel like Ricky Bobby after this. Mm -hmm. You know, so what do you do with your hands? <laughs> you lick. Then I have a fruit punch here that is a house fruit punch, so. You know, we need like an ice after that hot thing in the kitchen. Bro. Ice fruit punch. Yeah, man. Boy. That's nice. It have like a ginger <sighs> undertone as exactly. well. Exactly. I think everything has ginger here. Yeah, man. Everything I, have a little spice I, of something. I tried this one too and it has some ginger. What's that? Sorry? It, it's, no, she said it's this, but that oh, doesn't sound... Grape? Crime grape? I think it's cranberry. Yeah. Crime grape. It tastes like it, but it also has some ginger and something else in it. I gotta say bye to the women here. They're amazing. My friends, thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome, David. Thank you. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Respect Appreciate it. Respect, respect. Bless respect. Up it's all respect. Yeah, and you, hey, don't worry <laughs> about a thing. Cause every little thing is gonna be all right. She wanted a hug. <laughs> all right, that's been a heavy day. Blue Mountains, coffee, aqua and saltfish, Trini Doubles, so good, nice and spicy and sweet. Now we're gonna get back in the car and we're gonna go for some, I think it's Caribbean Chinese food, I think. Let's go. Kingston's too hot, too hot, guys. Oh my gosh. Where's that coconut guy? Where is he? So we're driving through uh, Kingston right now? Yeah. And uh, we're going next to have some, uh, what, some fusion? We're going to have some, yeah, Asian fusion, Asian Jamaican fusion food with some, he says that he has a little jerk pork with some noodles and stuff like that. So I'm, I'm interested to see exactly what this is like. Chinese Jamaican food? Jamaican food. We're going to walk on. Haka haka. <laughs> walk and roll, man. Taste it. Guaranteed amazing. Walk and roll. Taste it. Guaranteed amazing. I love the slogan. Bring in the sauce, of course. Jamaican food. This guy. Whoa. Hey, how you doing? What's up, man? How you doing? Everything good? Yeah. Let's do it. Let's do it. Oh, man. What is this? It's pork. It's pork? Yeah, it's pork. Woo! Jerk pork. The smells so nice. Oh, this is like a Chinese sauce. No, it's a like chicken sauce. And it's the lemon. Oh, oh. sorry. 
All right, let me try a little piece. Oh. That fat layer on top. Oh, wow. Best trick of my life right here. No, seriously, this is amazing. Whoa, because it has a nice, like, glaze. Yes. It's like glaze, got some pepper, some salt, the fat layer. All right, let's do this. Different. And it's spicy now. Different. Have the spice, but it has a sweet condensation from that. Like the, the cinnamon on it that you put in there. Not that people don't know that. Cinnamon is something that people put in their jerk sauce as well, or their jerk marinade. But to have it on that, really brings a different flavor, a nice fusion. The famous pork jerk noodles. Yeah, man. Woo! And they're on fusion. fire. Fusion. Jamaican Asian fusion. So have dip and you, go, you dip, I dip. But we all have to take a little piece of that pork. And as we in Jamaica say, not noodles, no good. No good. You know, my Italian friends are always mad at me because I'm like, Marco Polo brought the noodles. Yeah. <laughs> Let me not start, start a war that, in Italy. I can't even get you can't get in. Hold on, hold on. Try, try. Yeah, come on. There we go. Let's go. Ready? Ready? Yeah. The hell with it. Let's just go. I love that. I love this, the taste, the flavors. It's a like nice sweetness, that cinnamon. You get in there, I need to try some like, pork with it. Mm. Them fucking walk this. My hand's on fire. I'm literally on fire. Yo, you want me? No, here. They have a thing in Jamaica, say, see? You see why I said the fork? Look at that. The fork is this try. That's why them, my name is Matthew. They have a thing in Jamaica. They say, Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John, put on the fork and name with your hand. The lemon fish. Looks like a lemon gravy. Like a nice, a nice sweetness. Cheers, my friend. Cheers. Nice, strong lemon flavor. Yeah, super strong. Whoa, I haven't had lemony flavor like that. It's been a while. Yeah, and it's a super soft fish. But it's not overpowering. It's not overpowering. It's flaky, it's flaky. Um, it, it, it has moisture in there. It's not cooked until it's dry and, and lacking anything. It keeps the flavor. It's encrusted it in and allowed the moisture to stay within the basa. Basa. I was told not to eat too much. The rice is bathed in the sauce. Amazing lemon. Yeah, man. So lemon much lemon in Jamaica. In Walk and roll pepper sauce. So it's just oh, drop it there. I want to try that in my hand. My hand, just, yeah, man, see there. Uh, what kind of old pepper sauce this is? Come on, I'm going to dissect this right now. Not too hot flavor. Let's see. It reminds me of yeah, the Trini peppers. You have a little, you have a little <coughs> tang in there of a type of vinegar. Yeah. I don't know if it's a sweet vinegar that's in there, which is like a rice wine vinegar or something that, that, that is in there, but it's it kind of sweet. It felt almost like tamarind with pepper. Yeah, man. It's but it doesn't have tamarind. That was amazing. My man, thank you so much. Welcome. Appreciate you. Record breaking heat. Yeah, it's just fucking Well, it did go through July 4th through July 8th was the hottest days on record in world history. Yeah. World history. Broken right now, I can't see it. Again? Do you think today is the hotter day? It feels really fucking hot. Here it's freaking hot. The hottest day in recorded history, huh? Probably. Oh my gosh. I fell asleep in the car. <laughs> so we're here at the Devon this is place? Devon House. Devon House. Yeah, but this is a place that the government, the tourism, are trying to push as the food mecca for Kingston. So it will become a hub for all Jamaican foods and varieties of foods. So tomorrow we're coming back for specific things, but today we were literally coming here just to go to ATM, but we're also going to probably try either a patty or a Rasta pizza. I've heard about pizza and a Rasta pizza. Oh my Rasta gosh. Pizza and Rasta, Rasta pizza? pizza? Sounds awesome. I mean, I, I want to try. This place is cool. Nice. So it's like old school. Feels like colonial yeah, building. This is from 1923. This was built by Stippel, which was the first black millionaire in Jamaica. 1923? Yeah, they made their money from mining gold in South America. We're going to link Max. Max is a Rasta Italian Jamaican, half Italian, half Jamaican, that makes some of the best pizzas. Um, so you have the Italian side of him that make the pizzas and the Jamaican side of him that just goes crazy with the toppings and stuff, like Aki and different things. 
Italian Jamaican. So does he speak Italian Patois? Yeah. No way. <laughs> Joke. <laughs> What's up, man? How you doing? Well, well, Max. Nice David, nice pleasure. Nice to meet so you one. speak Italian? Yes. Sì? Italiano, 100%. No. Sì, è veramente italiano? Sì, sì mare italiana. Grande. Sì, Vabbè. guarda, Italia qui. Il prossimo anno metto a Jomega qua. Ciao, Rock qua. Ciao, Rock. Buonissimo. Pick up. All right, so, you so, want to try the Jamaican pizza, that one? Aki and Kalaloo. That, that one? Right. Oh, yes, please. Aki, oh, Aki and Kalaloo. Yeah, I know Aki and the, the real mix, like me. <laughs> Perfect, bro. Italian Jamaican. All okay. Right, and don't you have a grappa? No, grappa no, no. Ah, Sambuca. Ah, Sambuca, <laughs> have you? La mosca, sì. Sì, lo che tu vuoi. Sì, si vuoi provare qualcosa. Per la camera, per la camera. All right, I'm gonna make a Jamaican pizza for you guys, all right? Va bene. So now you're gonna come over here. Let's go, let's go. You can take it from here, so. This is the real Jamaican style, not Italian. So that's a green herb. Kalaloo, like spinach. Like spinach. So Kalaloo is a very green... Yeah, man. It, it, it's, it's a leaf-like substance that we use. It's America would say collard greens. It's not the same thing. It is just a plant that we like. Wow, beautiful pizza. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then again. All right. See? See? Pizza. Original Rastafari, red, golden, green. That's a real forno. Yeah, That's the real you, thing. Let me tell you though, the good, the wicked thing about oh, yeah. it, he made it. Oh, and elevates. <laughs> what? <laughs> Come on, I have the question. I saw, how'd you do this? Well. I, I, I ship some parts from Italy. Then with this guy, we set this engine, uh, 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 a motor, uh, allow me to make this. It's like hydraulics. This spin and go up and down. Yeah, so it's the hydraulics on it. Hydraulics. That's the coolest oven I've ever seen so in my life. It's gonna be ready in one minute 35. That's it? Facile. Yeah, Whoa, look, it's on fire. We have Scotch bonnet infused oil right here. That's on right top my head. Beautiful, and everything yeah, yeah. stays on top. Everything. And then he said to add some of this, so for me, I always do. You? Definitely need pepper, for sure. Pepper. And I, I, should I hold off? I want some of that. There you go, drizzly. It's got scotch bonnet infused oil. It's like spicy olive oil. I'm excited, dude. Jamaican pizza. Mmm. It's really good. It's going viral. It's really good. The dough's amazing. Absolutely. It tastes like an Ita Italian pizza out of Napoli. Oh man. Mm. I just got the stuff on it, olive oil on that. The greens of the kalaloo. You know, I would never know this is true. I would think you had it like, I don't know, like a muscle or something. Yeah, the, the, the aki itself, the creaminess of it goes well with that cheese, with the pepper. Just enough tomato sauce, very light on the cheese. Yeah. I love the crust. Jamaica's motto is out of many one people. Meaning there are many Jamaicans, but we have we have, there's a mixture of Jamaicans pretty much. I love and it. To have Max doing this, representing half of Italy, half of Jamaica, and putting the sunshine pizza with the Jamaican colours. This is the coolest pizza I've ever seen. <laughs> I, mean, I thought Hawaiian pizzas were nice looking because of pineapple. Try a Jamaican pizza. Rasta <laughs> pizza, rasta pizza. Oh, okay. See, mi familia de Umbria. Ah, okay. See, de, de Gubbio. My dad. Sure. Everybody knows my, my family's town because it's medieval town. Really? It's like one of the best preserved medieval towns you'll ever see in Italy. See, sí, it's bellissimo con el teatro romano. So I have a Roman theater here. Sí, sí. Sí, de Italia. Tú, tú sé de 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 qua. Voy a de qua. Yeah, yeah. See, it's yeah. amazing. I haven't yeah, spoken yeah. Italian like in a month, and then it's like back it's in my head. Right oh yeah, it's back home. <laughs> Yo, we have big money. Oh man. After, after this, we'll, we'll, we'll enjoy hey, a little bit. Where are you from in uh, Venezuela? Hey, Miami. Ah, Miami. Sì, sì. Mi, mi genitori sono nati a Venezuela. Yeah. Madre di Umbria, Italia. Mi, pa, mi babbo è di Ungheria. Mamma mia. Sei una meschia. <laughs> Ma così è sempre. 
Okay. It's amazing. It's amazing. Blessed. 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 All right. All right. That was great. This guy's guy awesome. Yeah, man. Mm. I'm right here with a scotch bonnet. Let me come on that scotch bonnet sauce on it and just break it out. Whoa. What I love about this pizza is the dough, and that is the oven. That oven yeah. makes it like flaky, nice and crusty. It's a very nice dough. So the Kalalu and the Aki are unique, but what makes it extra special is this Ooh, scotch, scotch bonnet. bonnet. Oh, oil. so good. Yeah, man. It's like hot. Added the like, heat to that sweet. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> Andiamo veloci, eh? faccio uno, due, tre, quattro, cinque. Come tu vuoi, sì. Uno, due, tre, quattro, cinque. Bene. Voilà. Been in Jamaica a long time, like 15 years, but I opened this place like seven years ago. And since that day, we never stop. Pizza, pizza, pizza every day. We gonna do an average of two, three thousand pizza per month. So I believe we, we have a goal. I mean, we, 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 we reach a. Huh? You make the, the heart pizzas. That's for women or what yeah, is? That's for all the women heart, heart pizza. Then we have star pizza for the VIP, for the real star people. And we can do any kind of shape actually. But yeah, I love shape pizza differently. I can do bread pizza, I can do cakes, quiche and pizza as well. I mean, I love mix, I love create new things. Like composing music, same way we compose food, like art. It's art for me. So, yeah man, come a la pizzeria Jamaica. Zin, Kingston, Devon House. So we're leaving the amazing Devon House. Look at that directory right here. Lots of restaurants, so many. Yeah. We might go to the jerk box tomorrow. Sure. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Well, we're going tomorrow, we're going to the home of jerk. The home of jerk, exactly. And so right now we're going to a place to have more fusion, yeah. Jamaican fusion food. It's tapas, Jamaican tapas. twist. Tapas. With some greenery. With, with some <laughs> green herbery. <laughs> Bro, we got... What's this guy doing? Jerk box. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> These cab drivers are wild, dude. No, it's hilarious because out of nowhere we hear guys honking hardcore honks like. No, why? What's wrong with them, man? They, they're in a rush to try to make as much money as they can to drop somebody yeah. off and stuff like that. The problem is they might kill somebody like that, so. And next up, we're going to Epicon Tapas and Lounge. Hey, how you doing? Uh, I love your space. It feels like I'm on South Beach right now. Okay, I'm Destiny. David, pleasure. Nice to nice meet you. Nice to meet you. Fantastic. So we're going to have some tacos. We're going to go in the back and see how they make them. Breadfruit taco? Jackfruit taco. Jackfruit, Jackfruit taco, not breadfruit. Jackfruit tacos. Perfect. Perfect. So we have both shell. We have country shell and south shell. Which do you prefer? Mmm, I'm a crunchy. Uh, I'm a crunchy guy. Crunchy. Crunchy. Yes. All right. Okay, come, follow me. I mean, this is awesome, this place. Yeah, man. This is Jamaica have a nice side too, and it's not always the local country shop them that have the best food. You have other places that are very nice with very nice dining. Hey, how you how doing? You? David, pleasure. Good. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Awesome. So you seen me before? I have seen your show. Oh, amazing. Thank yeah. you. Thank you. Welcome this is good. Uh, it's not your first time, is it? Second time. I need water. <laughs> I've had like five glasses of water and I'm still dying. <laughs> it hot and rotted today. It hot, man. It hot. It hot. That, that was the best one yet. <laughs> it hot, man. It hot. <laughs> and if you want to know what you're going you to send it. Like, it not as good. It's not real fun. That looks really good. Yeah. You want me to put it? Hey. Yeah, I never told you guys um, I'm Joey. And I am the sous chef. You're the sous chef? Yeah, I'm the sous chef. Can you talk to God and tell him to turn up the, the air? Oh, Father God. Like, Please, turn this on down. I can't even understand. Like, I hate to yeah. complain this much, but damn. Yeah, man. I never saw this hot, man. Look at this. Melting. I mean, we're in the heat. Outside yeah. is like 100 and something, right? Fahrenheit? It says it feels like 107. 
Yeah, you need to choke off in our river. Yeah. yeah. Right. It's, need, it's a cold shower territory. Yeah, it, it, I need to be in a freezing shower. Yeah, freezing. Ice cold. Ice should not be. Alright, so you're gonna put this in? My man, Joey, thank you so much. Yeah, Jackfruit tacos. Yeah. I'm ready. I need to get out of this kitchen. It's too hot. Turn on the vents. Okay. Let's go, let's go. Make our way through. Oh, I can't breathe, guys. I can't breathe. Be careful. For barbecue, Jackfruit tacos, I'm empty. Right. Okay? Wow. Nice. This looks beautiful. Nice hard shell. Oh, we got more. <laughs> All right. This is our Esco Beach fries. Esco Beach fries. Perfect. Nice. That looks good. Nice crispy fries, some salt, Esco Beach on top. Yeah, man. You have like a mayo on yeah, the side? Yeah, it was a, what did you say, a scotch bonnet, aioli type thing that's going on. on the Everything side, scotch or, bonnet. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> For sure. All right, ready? Bye, boys. Yeah. Let's do it. You going into this? Grab and bite into that crunch. Ready? Uh, barbecue. Yeah, man. More sweet than tangy. But you get the tang from the pico de gallo. Mm hmm. That jackfruit, though. Oh. You would never know it's jackfruit. No. It mimics anything that you put seasoning to. Like we said in the kitchen, look like pulled pork. Cabbage, the crunch, and the sweetness. It's a good taco. Yeah, man. It's almost like marinated pork. Grab a fry with Grab some escovich. With some escovich that sauce with oh, I'm leaving on. too much. And then like this. There's no such thing as too carrot. The pickled onion and carrot on top. It gives it like a vegetable feel yeah, with it, pickles. It hints it's almost like the fry. It's almost a little healthy. I hate mm -hmm. to say it. Mm. I got barbecue sauce on my nails, everything. And this is like scotch bonnet mayo, I think. Oh yeah, that's the scotch bonnet mayo. Or is it, no, I think it was um, this, Escovich infused mayo. Reminds me of a little tartar sauce type of vibe. Yeah, yeah, so I was just in Belgium. Can't beat the Belgian fries. But the reason why Belgian fries are so good is that they're, they're cooked in uh, beef fat. Right. So the oil is literally fat. Who else does that? McDonald's. Y McDonald's. Yeah. <laughs> they know what they're doing. <laughs> Well, bro, thank you so much for today. Yeah, man, it's been start, epic, bro. bro. Fusion Jamaican food in Kingston. What he said. <laughs> Good morning, day three here in Jamaica. And today we're doing a road trip. We're driving to the north part of the island. We're crossing over the Blue Mountains. You ready, Nate? I'm ready. Let's go. For my face. Yeah, it's gonna, be the, <laughs> it's gonna be the hottest day of all time. If yesterday was hot, today's gonna be hotter. We need coffee. That's the only problem with this Airbnb. When I have David's been here residences, it's gonna be coffee machine espresso or lava. Lava? What about some lava. cold brew? Some cold brew? No, I'm gonna have it set up. It's gonna be all set up. Ready? Ready? I'm on Portland, right? Red Portland. That's north of Blue Mountains. Yeah, man. Okay, so I was we're going it up. over and through. It's around 70 kilometers from Kingston. I'm going to the home on the I'm a jerk. Let's go. Let's go, my man. Wake up, wake up. <laughs> we need coffee. You know, the traffic jams in the morning here in Kingston are insane. And the traffic jam, I mean, the, the horns honking, it's like you're in India. This is a lot. They really lay down on it, like 30 seconds each time. Look, look, look. <laughs> like that. Exactly like that. It's like hardcore honks. So we stopped at a hotel at the end of this film. <laughs> it's all good. I'm not going to promote this coffee, but it's some good coffee. <laughs> So I want to show you guys where we're going today. We're going to Portland Parish. It's through the Blue Mountains. So we're crossing, we're in Kingston right now. We're going to drive up in, from St. Andrew Parish to Portland Parish. And then we're going to get to Buff Bay. Then from Buff Bay, we're going all the way across to this side of the island. This is the birthplace of Jerk, the first place that did Jerk. Correct? Correct. All right. No. 
And there's a lot of places there that are doing jerk at the moment. Yeah, where we're going in Boston Bay, there are multiple restaurants within that area. Boston Bay. Perfect. I'm excited. It's going to take us uh, roughly an hour plus to cross over. Let's go. This guy selling newspapers right there? Paper here. I, I, I haven't seen anybody selling papers in a decade. So what does it cost to buy a house on, on this road? A couple mil? Yeah. Because yeah. yeah. this is the best place to grow some coffee. No. We're no. on the other side of it. We're really going by John Crow Mountains on the outer end of Blue Mountains. If, the best place is where we went yesterday, continuing straight up. Got it. So right now we're entering St. Mary's Parish. So Kingston, St. Andrew, this is St. Mary, and, and we're going to Portland Parish. Yeah, here is just like heavy, heavy, lush green. Just trees everywhere, bamboo trees. What else is in here? I mean, very little houses, right? Like who, who lives up here? Just small, small spots. There's way more roar. We've been trying to stop, but everybody's closed. It's not open, it's not time. Yeah, it's way too early. All right. What's up, man? How you doing? Bless. You good? Bless? David, pleasure. Nice to meet you. Coconuts. Pineapple. Got small mangoes. Some banana. Right here we have one of my favorite things of all time. Breadfruit. We gotta roast it. You don't have a roaster here? I'm joking. So what can we try? Pineapple, can you cut anything for us? Yeah? So you're gonna do like a one chop? Maybe you just grab the top and you skin it? Yeah? Let's do one. That was good. So do you think that Jamaican pineapple is the best pineapple? In the world. In the world, In the world right? That smell is already. You do that. The secret. This is really the best. Pineapple right here on the side of the road. Best pineapples on earth. I don't know, my trunies might be offended, but look who we are right now. Oh, look at that. The cuts he's making, nice incisions. So what are you doing there? Take out the eye. Take out the eye. Yeah, that's it, don't scratch. A different method. Never seen like that. Hello? Jamaica only be like this, brother. All right, it's time to try this pineapple. Amazing. Not too sugary, not too sweet, though. It's not too dense. Mm hmm. Well, look right here. The way you cut it. Look at that. Nice piece. I love how you cut it. Mm. Respect, bro. Respect. So sweet. It's sweet, but to me, this is the F22. It have nice flavor. You see the small sugar pines. Total different experience on this. Oh, this wow. is like Trinidad pine. Mm -hmm. Not sweet like the little one. <laughs> oh, I don't know. These mangoes, I haven't seen them this small before. He's saying they're very sweet. This is how you eat a mango. This is how I learned how to eat a mango. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's sweet. For me, it's too ripe. I like it when it's almost there. Very small mango. I'm just pulling the moisture out. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. Done. I'm gonna try one of these nice soft bananas. I like the small bananas. They're easy to eat, full of potassium. Mmm. It's like a nice plantain. Mm -hmm. Look at my doodle, sweet plantain. Oh wow. Honey banana. Mm. This is it. This is it? I'm doing it. I want a young wash off your heart. 
Any jelly in there? A little bit. This is the spoon right here. Yes, sir. Spoon? Jelly? We all have no hands here. <laughs> oh, it's like nothing in here. It's empty. That's all we got. So we got the young jelly. It's like too little, man, too little. Yeah, man. I like it when you have a huge sheet. Nice. Not shot. Respect. Thank you so much, man. So $6.50 is the total. Uh, divide that by 140 so it's something like $6, $5 US? Yeah, that will be like just $5. Yeah, hey, bro. Keep that. Keep okay. that. Okay, bless me. Thank you. I gave you the right amount. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> All right, this guy's awesome. Stop here on the way down to Port Antonio. Thank you so much. Respect. <laughs> <laughs> my man, I'm sorry. What's your name again? Drizzy. Yeah. Drizzy. Yeah, walking TV. So yeah, walking TV? Yeah, man. So you guys are one of the biggest YouTubers in Jamaica, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Amazing. Yeah, one of yeah. the family yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. Awesome, dude. Yeah, so you don't know, so he's a big YouTuber as well. So. And you're from here, from Paris? Um, yeah, this is my parish. This is your yeah. parish. Yeah. Everybody have their own in their parish, you know? Exactly, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Awesome. I run this parish. He's someone of the man for the parish. Yeah. So. Perfect. Yeah, yeah. So he's linking us up with some of the people in this parish, and we might see him later for a yeah, cookout man. over there yeah. on the river. Yeah. Yeah. Respect, bro, respect. Yeah. Awesome. Let me know if this is an official channel. Pick up, sit now. All right, no problem, no problem, no problem. Oh, wow, look at the Rio Grande. You think it's a jerk? Oh, it might be some jerk. Jerk pork, chicken and beef soup. Something I didn't see there. So this gentleman over here, I'm sorry, what's your name? Willie, David, pleasure. Yeah, nice to meet you. Respect. So what do you have here? Some jerk? This is jerk chicken? First time smelling jerk in Jamaica. Oh man. And then what's over there, some pig feet? Chicken foot. Steppers, remember steppers. Steppers. I like the swimmers better than the steppers though. <laughs> Yeah, you see my face? In New York? New York. Dude, New York. That's my biggest fan base, bro. Thank you. So we're at the Hits Bar restaurant. I'm ready to eat. This is amazing. What does he have? Some uh, fried pork, chicken? Pork chops, fried chicken. Pork chops, fried chicken. That's almost cow foot. Yes, cow man. Foot. We need some of the That's cow That's what we're foot. doing, cow yeah, foot. Man. We're doing some exotic food yeah, today. Man, we need some cow foot. Thank you so much. Wow, it smells amazing. So rice and peas. Rice and peas. He's smiling, he's smiling. smiling. Let me see that. Wow, what a pot. Nice pot of rice and peas. Yes. And then you have this, that, you have the fried chicken, and you have the pork chops right there. It's pork chops? Yeah, yeah that is that's the pork, pork chops. chops. Wow. The marinade oh, is amazing. I can smell that. So rich. Yeah, I'm sorry, what's your name? Uh, my name is Raymond. Raymond. Yeah. Thank you for letting us film inside here. Okay, bro. So we're gonna go with uh, cow feet. Yeah. I think we should do pork chop. We should get some chicken, uh, the rice, of course, rice and peas, and then we have some cabbage, some salad. Let's have some good food. So Plus the view and some rum. And rum. <laughs> <laughs> what a place, man. Portland. That's where it's, that's where it's at. Yeah, not not Mobe. No. Ah, I'm messing with you. I love Portland. I'm gonna say I love Portland. So you want to put the the whole one? Yeah, I did. You have no idea the smell of cow feet. It smells so good. I don't even know how to explain that, the aroma in there with the fat. Voila. Perfect. It's like home style, man. You said you want a leg on the top. Is that what he said? Yeah, that's what he said. That's that was good, that's good. Oof. That's good, man, that's good. Just a little bit. Oh, I can't wait for this food. This is real good home cooking. I never show bathrooms in my life. I don't enjoy showing content about bathrooms. I think it's weird. But for this one, I got to show you. Adam and Eve. That was a 150 degree bathroom. <laughs> All right, let's go get a beer. Maybe some rum and eat some food. Now I'm a little disappointed in myself that I didn't come with a bathing suit. Should have done that. Oh, well, next time. Jamaica, you're only a one hour flight from Miami. I'll be here more often. Oh, man, I'm going in the bar. I'm serving myself. Yeah. This is a great bar, lots of space. You never run into anybody here. So what should we try? What do you got? B12? 
Beers, wine, Bailey's, stout, red stripe. Amazing. Uh, what do you think? What pairs perfectly with this? What well, I don't know. Which should I have? So which one? This one. Yeah, you can have that one. All right, we're ready. When you come to Jamaica, worse in Portland, this is it. This is the right rum. When you put this in your system, you got to digest it, man. This is it. Appleton Estates. Yeah, man, Jamaican rum. Let's do this. Give me a chop. Man. Yeah, man. I know white rum. Ooh. Yeah, because this is been put in barrels. Yeah. White rum, never put in barrels. No, this one is still in mm. barrels in St. Elizabeth. Not bad. It's established in 1749? Yeah, man. Nassau Valley, where's that? That is in St. Elizabeth. St. Elizabeth? Yeah. And where's so that? South side of the island. For food, and you want to share the food in Jamaica. When you get the box cover, you have to tear it and get a bridge in them one half. So you have two plates now. So now we can mix the foods without having to mix up the boxes. So the other thing where you say, see the box cover, you tear that. So you tear that and we share the food with the box cover. That's how it goes. So we tear the box cover. I have some of this. Now you have some of this. Right? Perfect. I have some of this. Now you have some of this. I have some of this. You have some of this. So you have some of this. Right. And then you have some of this. <gasps> yeah, man. And then I think this is the different one. That is a cow foot. You can't tell from the gumminess, the texture. Wow. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So that one was my. Which one? Yeah, yeah, that, that was yours. One that was yours. That one is yours. <laughs> I'm <laughs> trying, bro. I'm trying. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Yeah, man. This is cow. We're born, man. You just gotta suck on it. Yeah, man. Gelatinous. Mm -hmm. mm. That's the word, right there. It's sweet too. Cow foot is way better than chicken foot. More meat. Mm -hmm. More gumminess, more flavor. Wow! I'm gonna have to go into this guy though. Look at that. I'm in awe. This is orgasmic. Mm. Oh my God. Mm -hmm. mm. That took away the rum. You can't talk. <laughs> You, go, you, go. <laughs> you can't, bro. You can't. No, it's stuck. You can't. <laughs> mm -hmm. They actually used to make chewing gum with some of the parts from cow foot. Oh, yeah? Mm -hmm. I'm not gumming it. I love the rice and peas. The flavors peas. are so outstanding. Yeah, rice and peas. These are very small. I've had peas where it's like the whole thing is peas. Whole it's basically peas. dull, like split lentils. We have so much peas, but this is rice and peas. Mm -hmm. So the rice is more. I'll move some of this in here. Look at this. Put All the gravy. gravy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Gravy a little bit. I think that's pork chop right there. Very nice. I'm happy. Super happy. That crunch. Mm -hmm. That crunch. It's like a village chicken. Wow. What Jamaicans usually do with the fried chicken, they put curry goat gravy on it. Oh my gosh. I mean, this is outstanding. I love the crunchiness. Juice is coming out. So juicy. Very juicy. In fact, chicken breast is still juicy. Mm hmm. Fried rice. Right. We ready? We ready, man. Mm -hmm. mm. I love the marinade. Sweet. This is, this is amazing food. That's why I love my country. Mm. That got me there. Yeah, yeah. Short. Yeah, you need some water because you can't get this down. And I have a little bit of a salad here. Some cabbage, onion. The greenery. Mmm, nice and refreshing. Crunchy. Yeah, almost al dente, is it? Mm-hmm. I love al dente. Mm -hmm. If you eat pasta and it's not al dente, you're not eating pasta. Yeah, man. Take that one. We cheers to Miami. You know, you say salut in uh, Portuguese. Saúde. Saúde. The Italian? Oh. Brindiamo. Brindiamo. Oh, it's way different. Yeah, and then Brindiamo. German is Brindiamo. Prost. Yeah, that one I knew. Prost. Brindiamo. Prost is a, one of my favorite words. Brindiamo a tu saluji. A tu saluji. No, a tu saluji. That, that, that is better than KFC, bro. We'll know tomorrow, right? We'll learn tomorrow. 
We'll learn tomorrow. I haven't had the Jamaican KFC. I've heard legends. It's legendary. So what was your favorite here? Fair food. Everything. I don't I yeah. Seriously, I'm not even joking. From the cold food to the to the, to the pork to the fried chicken to the everything was good. I can't pick a favorite. The kalfa gravy on top of the um, rice and peas. Wow. My man, you killed out that food. So good. Yeah, it's a look, man. Hey, Every time. The cow hoofs. Yeah. The best. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that gravy. We are in Portland at first, in front of first and last bar. Got so it. that that's the first we hold to get. But this is each restaurant and bar. Perfect. Right? But you are in front of first and last bar. The first place to enter into Port Antonio. Got it. So you 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 are right here. And it's on the left. And Respect. the sea breeze and it's all good. Come here, eat, drink, get the view. If you can, jump in the water. And after you finish, you can go to Adam and Eve. Do <laughs> the, your thing. The best bathroom ever. <laughs> <laughs> I feel good. Da -da 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 -da. But the heat, my gosh. If you would have told me I would have been here in July, I would say no, bro. Oh, is that no, the view is epic. The whole ride is amazing. Just the whole time going along the coast. Yeah, so I, I'm... I think they're getting fruit punch. I'm getting the frozen coffee. You have frozen coffee available? Yeah? That's what I want, because it's Blue Mountain coffee, which is right here, plus some coconut rum. Keeping it traditional. This frozen coffee, Blue Mountain coffee with coconut rum. Mm. That's like a, it's got, we call this a mudslide. It's, yeah, right? <laughs> a lot of sugar. You feel that rum. Mm-hmm. Crab time? Hello, hello. We're going in the kitchen. Whoa, 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 whoa. These are not important crabs. These are Jamaican food coming. These are fresh out of Portland? Fresh out of Portland, see. This isn't from Alaska. No. No, no, no. no. <laughs> Alaska? Alaska? Curry goat. Curry goat. Oh, wow. We got that scotch bonnet. As soon as you smell it, there's spice in your nose. <coughs> Don't talk over that pot, boy. <laughs> mahi Mahi is my favorite. It's really the 21, it's all herbs and spices we put together and make our own seasoning. 21 spices? 21 herbs and spices. It looks like a nice roast. Yeah, man. Like a curry roast. Curry, yeah. the smell, the smell it starts to come up. Right? Burning the curry to get that flavor in. And we're over the fire right now. You can feel it, right? <laughs> I feel like you are melting. I'm melting. I'm just over dripping. Over steam right now. I'm over the pot, guys. Don't get mad at me. Stop getting mad. How are we alive? Yo, I don't know. Need a red stripe or something. Or something. I did, I, I, dude, I melted all the fat of the day. Everything melted out of me. All of that rum coming out of the pores right now. Oh God. It's like, dude, I just like lost 10 pounds. I'm gonna stay in here forever, bro. I'll fast in here. Coconut milk curry. Coconut curry. Coconut curry, king crab. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> curry crab, not crab curry. <laughs> this is our Roots 21 product. So that's your host purple. Yes. Can I try it? Oh, sure.
Not just happening, that flavor. Mm, cinnamon there. Yeah, we got flavor, we got flavor. Pimento. The rosemary mm -hmm. pimento. Pimento. Flavor, I like. I'm telling you. Pimento. That's, the, That's the secret ingredient yeah. of jerk. Nice. Oh, nice. that's fire. That's good. Woo. Dude, I'm like shaking. I don't know if it's the heat or the heat of this. Like, fire, man. It's like amazing, actually. Let's do some more. And I have one of that one we can go with. Yeah, man. <laughs> yeah, yeah, for sure. We'll buy one of that. That's every Thursday we make. Yeah, man. Every Thursday? Every yeah. Thursday we make fresh milk. Really? Yeah. So, no, 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 that preservative, nothing. Yeah. We use the alcohol as the preservative instead of the. This will give you wings, bro. Oh. Wings are fire. I need to get out of that kitchen. I can't anymore. I don't know how you guys do it. I'm proud of you. Oh my gosh. Let me breathe, let me breathe. Oh, where's upstairs? This way. How bad do I look? Woo! Bad. Nate, I'm bad. Yeah, take this. Let's go. Ray Rock. Let's go. Oh man. Monster. What are you guys doing to us? Hmm. Look at that. Look at this. It's the mountain. This is my favorite meat. Oh, I'm sure. Man. Caribbean king crab, not Alaska. Caribbean king crab. Yeah, man. Thank you. Some rice and peas. Yeah, man. Well, that's some press planting and some roti. Roti. Yes. So press planting, that's press called tostones. 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 Yes. What we call it press planting. And that's some roti. And roti. Roti or chapati. I don't know, people are gonna get mad at me all over goat, the Caribbean, curry right? Curry goat as well. Curry goat. Roots yeah, 21 man. jerk sauce. The roots 21 jerk sauce. So now I come with the fire and I'm have the 99 degree burn for sure. Third degree, sorry. <laughs> it's amazing. Thank you. No more? I load some more. Thank you. Yeah, load some more. For you, my man. Right, sorry, so I skipped yes, you. Yes, man. Also. And lastly, we have what we came here for. King how we, Crab. How do we even grab this? You just go dig right in. Look, this is for you. You're the guest, you know, so you can, you can take it if you want it. The sauce is so More? rich. Oh, we can start with this. Yeah, I'll start with that. I'm gonna get this guy right here. Yeah, man. Big piece. Oh, you have one more piece right here. But you know what I'm gonna do? You don't mind me touching it with my hands. No, you're fine. I'm sure I won't get crushed up by your No, hands. you're good. <laughs> and by the way, we're right next to the street. That's why we have a lot of cars passing by. But get some of that curry. Right there. Yeah, that is curry sauce. Oh, the sauce has went right down in there. So mm -hmm. all of that sauce has touched the meat. Flavor upon flavor. Mm. Baby. Oh, yeah, baby. Jeez, I'm pleased. There's so much meat. It's so sweet, so tender. Mm. It's just everything you want in your life. Coconut and curry together? Mm. I'm telling you, this is like, you're going back to mama. Mm-hmm. My pants are curry pants. Yeah, this stain on Jamaica. It's fine. <laughs> it's the right stain. No, oh, I natural it's lemonade. Fun. It's so easy to eat. Yeah, man. So much flavor. It's like India, Africa, and the Caribbean had a baby in a crab. <laughs> and this is what came out. Right? Keep going in here. Mm. My hand's still on fire. Now I'm gonna go in here for some of that dough curry. Wait, so we're eating with our hands, might as well. Mm -hmm. So you're eating the curry goat already? Let's get the flavor of that goat. Ram goat. Whoa. If you ever go to India, you can get this. You know what it's called? Goat awesome. roast. Goat roast. Then put it in like a hot pot though. And yeah. Same thing, just like a curry yeah, man. with roast. No, almost no gravy. Mm. This one has some nice gravy though. Good flavor on the curry goat as well. Mm -hmm. but let us try a pepper in the kitchen. 
I think I need some of that pepper. Mm. I just can't. Mm. But pairs well with the curry, with the curry goat, with the curry crab, and the rice and peas. Oh, that's up to the chef, man. Much respect. We can keep going in here. And there's so much meat floating around. Mm -hmm. The crab no more got Oh my god, you get the hair of the crab? Look at the hairs. Just soaking up with that. Top of the milk. What are we doing here? Uh, feasting on some Caribbean king crab. Oh my gosh, it was like, almost like when you get the bone marrow out of the bone. Same thing. So much fun. My man. Respect. Best curry crab of all time. <laughs> all right. All time. You say, you say it right this time. No, no, all time. <laughs> you, 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 you say it right this time. Right? <laughs> Not crab curry. <laughs> you guys tell me. What's These guys up? love food. Yeah, man. <laughs> Kill me. <laughs> Hey, Bruce 21 Kitchen. Hey, the best, give bro. me a quick photo right here. Like yeah, it's still photo, still photo for sure. All right, let's go. We're in Port Antonio. This is actually the square right here. What you want, man? We're here for some Rasta stuff. This is great. Look how dramatic we're being with Stone Inch. Look at this, yes. Yes. But he has some mass. Look, Rastas, real Rastas. This is amazing. This is like giving homage to Bob Marley with some of these. They look like Bob. What do you think? What's the prices on this? My man, how much for these? How much for like some of these? They're different prices. So, I mean, uh, I like this one. I like this one too. The price on them. The price on them? Yes. So what is this? Nine k. Nine thousand for this? Yes. Very you get special bag. But there's a little dust. I have to get the dust off. Oh, I got it. I got it. Because of the road. I just wanted one of those like more like Bob. Like I, I actually. All of those. This is dope. All I need to do get off the dust because of the road. I like it. It's big. Price. I don't need to negotiate, just give me a good deal, man. Give me a good deal. Huh? 120. 100. All right. Oh, wow. You okay, deal. okay. You have your deal. I'll get something else for my kid. Yes. I'm waiting on that guy until he finish. <laughs> wow, this is beautiful. What is this? A red shirt back on. Just, this is just wood? Yes, yeah, wood. It's wood. That's freaking awesome. Everything by hand? Yes. By you? Yeah, man. Oh, you? Look around, you can go and look at the wood. Are you carving anything now? Yes. You are? Yes. Oh, my God. So I just carve. look at this. You take the picture of this girl and this boy. Mahogany. What do you have? A cedar. A cider wood. Yes. All right, we're going to see him carving. That's the carving center right there. Carving center right there? Yeah. That's the carving center. Are you center. carving yeah, anything man. now? The chip, eh? Are you doing I'm anything I'm just now? working on some repairing some right around there. Okay. My man, thank you so much. God bless my thank brother, you. God bless. Oh, it's going to be great. It's going to go on my wall. Yes. So I got the Bob that resembles, or the rust that resembles Bob Marley. I great tell you piece. something, Charlie Brown will in that flame. You see, have the artist in that flame. Exactly. You burn your hand in that flame. Yes. I awesome. hope you see it one day. Yeah, one day I'll see you again, okay? Yes. Guys, come here, buy some stuff. He has beautiful pieces, all done by hand. Turtles, fish, Rasta men. I mean, Everything. so many things. You name it, he has it in terms of wood carving. Look at this girl. This girl is dope. Look at this. We're in Boston. So Boston is known as the home of jerk. This is about a half a mile where it was or the first jerk pit in Jamaica was. And then this is basically the birthplace of it. It's where the genesis was of it being sold in Jamaica. And you know jerk is the original Jamaican food. You heard it first from us. I'm excited. I love jerk chicken. <laughs> Let's go. Super hot day, hottest day in history. What up, man? Respect. Freshly from Jabuku, right in Boston Bay, Jamaica. Sin. Let's do it, my man. Yeah, man. Here ice you go. Cold. Yeah, man. Here. All right. Ooh, ice Beautiful. cold. Yeah, man. Sin. Freshly squeezed. It match our hand. Show it. Yeah, man. Sin. <laughs> Sugar cane, turmeric. Sugar cane, turmeric with ginger, lemon, and lime. Ging right here in Jabuku shop. 
Boston Bay, Portland, Jamaica. Oh, so That's healthy. Mm. Yeah, man. Dude, this is the best. Yeah, man. Yes, man. This is pure God's green earth right here. Everything you need. Everything man. you need. Yes, man. Right here in Boston Bay, Portland, man. Just come and check me out. Yeah, man. Brother. Wow, that's so good. Yes, sir. We're going to go inside, okay? Yes, Thank you. One love. Uh, one love. Yes, cool, yes, cool, runnings, cool runnings, cool runnings. Cool runnings. It's amazing. We're here. I've been so excited about this place the whole time because he told me about it. Like when we set this trip up about a month ago, it was like the birthplace of jerk. I was like, what? Finally. Oh, yes. Chicken here? So we're going to the end right now. We'll, we'll, we'll pass by everybody. We're going to pass by everybody. Look here. Look here. Let's just see him. Let's just see him. See him. Open it up. Oh, wow. Some chicken. That's the chicken. That's the fish. That's the lobster. This is the chicken salmon. They're going to make you a salmon. And this is how I work every day. I'm not only just talking. I have quality. What is this? Chicken sausage. Look at the sign. Come and take that. Chicken sausage. Bumpy is famous. Give me a tiny piece. Tiny piece. I'm on a, a four round. Oh, I gave four. Yeah, I saw four person. I gave four sample. So our man here is Bumpy's Jerk Sausage Bumpy. Jerk Chicken. Bumpy. 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 Yeah, man. Original. Any See other, so. any other Bumpy, it must be carbon copy. Our younger Bumpy. He's on the beach. Oh, that pepper. Younger Bumpy teach surfing lesson on the beach. This one is big. So we get this. Straight into the pepper, right? Uh, it's hot. Uh, real uh, Jamaican stuff, man. Take it out. Real Jamaican stuff. Right. Nice. Nice. Originated by the bumpy. See you. Come on. I'm in the board. So tender, though. First, you gotta turn on that music off. <laughs> Let's go in here. Little David's Jerk Center. I'm coming to you after, bro. But turn off the music. <laughs> How you doing, man? Woo! What are we doing here? This is where we do all the jerk. Oh, wow! Yeah, this is the port. Whoa! We got the ribs, okay. we got the neck, we got the head, we got the foot, we got everything. The last time I was this happy, I was in a barbecue yeah. in Arizona with Mark Weens. The smoke was like this. Yeah. Amazing, amazing. Respect the crop, that, that is necessary. One piece of ribs and you know what? Sample, let's yeah. go. Right here. This is jerk. You ready for that? Me? I'm born ready for this. Born ready. The next one at all. That reminds me of like brisket. Everything in oh, it's pork. Mm -hmm. I know, I know, it's yeah. pork, it's amazing. This Somebody might be the first time I try um, jerk pork. Yeah, because jerk chicken is more common. Jerk pork is the original. Cause what happened was you had wild boar throughout Jamaica. And with that spice, extra kick. Mm -hmm. Scott's bonnet as well? Yes, Scott's bonnet. I'm going to eat it need now. It's a red stripe. A red stripe. Yeah, no. So where's the bar? Me and you know, it's not a red stripe, you know. Yeah. To me, I'm I need that spice. The best, best jerk of all time. No, the pork is the best. Before we eat the jerk pork and jerk chicken, I'm gonna get a red stripe. Two red stripes. Two red stripes. Two red stripes. Let's do this. You got ginger beer. You got red stripe. He has smoothies. What's your name? What's the name of this place? Daiquiri Palace. The Daiquiri Palace. So Daiquiri Palace and over there we have smoothies and music. Oh, we only need two. They didn't want. Yeah. Red Stripe. This is something to record. Yeah, this is four. A bottle open. A bottle open in the bottle. That's amazing. Yeah, man. Red Stripe. Real cold. Yeah, man. That's the best combination for some jerk pork on a hot summer day like today. I'll pay you now. Thank you. It's okay, man. Take your time. Thank you. Thank you so much. Homo jerk, jerk chicken, jerk pork, Jamaica. The real jerk. This is it. This is it. The final event. No, this is not the final. We'll have a little more. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, it's been a long day. The main event, the main event. Ready? We, we, we got to start. You need something with a little, a little bit of fat, a little bit of lean, and that will just flavor. You see the crack that's on mm -hmm. it, that bark? Like if you don't see bark, it's not jerk. 
That's amazing. Yeah, man. Look at that fat layer. The crust. That is it. I ran into a piece of fat as well. Can we get some, some spice too? Pepper sauce. Yeah, of course. Mm. Pork rinds. Mm -hmm. Whoa. It is smoke, which has to be part of jerk. If you don't have smoke in Jamaica. <laughs> no, 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 of course, of course. Dude, I'm in awe with that bite. It was the ultimate layer of jerk. You have fat, then you have meat, then you have spice, then you have more spice. The rub on this is something that is what makes it. The style of cooking, I mean, you look at mine, you see that? That's smoke that's in there. That's all smoke. And that pairs perfectly with this. That is true. The red stripe will push that right down. Well, especially with the heat, you need a red stripe. Red stripe will cool you off right There's up. a reason there's a lager as a national beer of all these yeah, Caribbean man. countries. <laughs> because if you don't have this, you're done. It's, it's water, so Jamaican, water, Yeah, yeah, it's Jamaican this, water. Done. <laughs> so we're missing chicken. Chicken is here. Finally. So chicken breast over here with some skin. And some wing and soft with the skin. So dive right in, but you need to get peace with the skin on or somewhere where the jerk had marinated. Like that. Yeah, yeah man, when you chop sometimes, it, that one that kind of look dry, but. <laughs> yeah, it's dry, but I'm gonna get this with a little bit of pepper. It's gonna be hot. This pepper is spicy. Oh man, I have to dip on it, get all the pepper like it. I know, pepper, I know, so. I know. Get in there with it. Ready? It's actually juicy. It wasn't too dry. But you did get a little bit of that skin. You have to get the skin, if not, you're not gonna get that marination. Marinade's supposed to soak right to the bone. Mm. And get that smoky flavor. For the first time in my life, I'm gonna say I prefer pork over chicken. <laughs> this pork. Come on, the pork you just keep going. I'm going, I'm going. So tender, so juicy. There's the fat always. So more flavor than the chicken because of the fat that drips down into it. Yeah, you can see it. No fat here, no matter what, you have some. Wow. We have one more to try. Mm -hmm. We're fine, we're finishing. Pork sausage, pork ribs. Yeah, it looks amazing, but after seeing the pork tied up, I got sad, man. Yeah. Oh, but it's life, it's life. I get juice to the gun tie chicken. Look at it. Well juicy. Well seasoned? Well seasoned. Seasoned to the bone. Hold on, I'm dying, guys. The heat in here is outrageous. Outside 100, in here 125, 150. What are you making here, my friend? Festival. 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 We love festival. Very good. The festival in your mouth. And fried bread fruit. That's what, oh, oh fried bread fruit. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Fried bread fruit. Right here. Yeah. Smells so good. Yeah, you know? Nate. All right. So now you have the jerk chicken. You have to try a piece of this one. So this one is fresh off. You have pepper over there. And you have the spices on it. You can look and see the spices on it. Dig in. Which one you want? Any piece, man. You take up. This with some spice? You know, I would try it without the spice first. Okay, on the, the side. side. Then. Yeah. And then see how the flavor is on that. I don't even try it yet. Very flavorful. Lots of spices. Still very tender and juicy. You got the skin? Mm hmm. Oh, that's how I got the spice. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. Just coming off the bone. It's supposed to be right down into the bone, and so it's supposed to be soaked. Oh my gosh. Watch it, watch it, watch it. Come in, too. Come in, too. Come hot soap, hot soap, hot soap, hot soap. Okay. Inside the bone, you can see the marination of the jerk. That's why it's so good. It gets super deep into the bone, and they let it sit there probably like a day or two. I don't it's even know the marination. Soak right down to the bone. Yeah, Marinate for at least 24 hours. 24 hours minimum? Minimum. So, some places do it for a week. Oh my gosh. That's a good chicken. Yeah, this one's way better. Yeah, man. That's <laughs> mm. Oh my gosh. Check this piece of skin right there, sir. This one has. That one. See it there? That's right the skin. There. That's where you see the jerk. That's where you see the jerk. Marinated jerk, spices, 24 hours. Then they put it onto this hot oven, smoked. Smoke. Smoke with flavor, smoke with pimento wood. Whoa. It's supposed to be slow cooked, low and slow, so you get that juice and you keep that juice in it. It falls apart. Yeah, man. So easy to eat. That's amazing chicken, but the pork still wins. 
pork. The pork wins every day. <laughs> the pork, the pork is the best. Chicken is, I, I'd be like, 10 is pork, chicken is one. That's the difference. <laughs> Solid. Yeah, yeah. I'm done with this. What happened to my face? No, I think I already took four showers today. This is a real summer in Jamaica. A real summer. This is the most the heat ever. Ever hot. I ever feel Record. like this. Ever feel like this in Jamaica. If you can survive this, yeah, man. Forget COVID. We, we, we used to it. We used to it so we can live with it. But it's not good for everybody, you know? Nah. Some people run yeah. out of it. We have to take it because we are a black, strong Jamaican. Yeah, we love it. I love, love you, bro. I love you. Sunshine is not for Amazing. me alone, for everyone. Come and enjoy it in Jamaica, the best place. Chicken, lobster, conch, and rolls, we have it here. Jelly water, wash off your heart. Don't hitch, up, don't hitch when you come at Baston, man. Everything is here. We do all surfing down at the beach there. Welcome to the thing, man. I'm Mr. Boom Blast to Baston every time. Up, up, shop. We're leaving the home of Jerk, and we're going to go look for some more food. Maybe some more Jerk. I don't know. Yeah. I'm uh, really uh, looking forward to trying more jerk, to be honest. Well, I didn't get my fix. Didn't get my fix. I wasn't impressed. I'm not impressed at all. You weren't impressed? No, that was horrible. <laughs> I mean, you're the boss. <laughs> if the boss says it. Wow. This one right here? Right here? I would buy this thing. So right in there is one of the deepest spots. You can jump off of that tree and go down. They usually have tours. There's a restaurant, so it's a heritage spot. So they close this off now to the work on the road. And then hopefully they'll open it back to the public soon. Can I just put my feet in the water? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna do it really fast. Really fast. I, just, I haven't touched the water in Jamaica, man. It's the first time I'm gonna go in the water, so. Yeah, yeah. Ugh. Oh, yes. You know, I haven't had time to go to the beach on this trip at all. We haven't gone to any water yet. And we're in Kingston, which is less touristic. You know, Montego Bay and the Grill, Ocho Rios, that's where all the beaches are. Kingston, there's beaches, of course, but it's less touristic. And obviously, I'm here for food, so it's the first time I you know, have been able to put my feet on the sand. And like Sadhguru says, you should always, like every single day, 30 minutes a day, put your feet onto the ground and get the energy of the earth. We're forgetting that part of our humanity with all this technology and being with shoes on. It's great. How you guys doing there, good? Hey. Dude, the view from here is amazing. I can't even imagine from up there. This is a jungle right here. 300 years ago, Columbus and his invaders coming in here. 400 years ago. We're going all the way back now, and uh, we're finding some more jerk, maybe some patties. We don't really know. We'll see what happens. It's already 5.40. We've been out here. Uh, we started at 8.30, we got some coffee, and it's been a long day. It's a long one. Wow. You know, it's beautiful though. Look at this yeah. sunset right here. It's fantastic. Thankfully, it's not hot anymore. No, that's it. <laughs> I feel great now. That's it's amazing the, the difference in the feeling, huh? Yeah. So we were like... So we're gonna get some jerk chicken here at Piggy's Jerk Center. Of course, we have to get at least one more fix of jerk. Yeah, man, we can't leave Portland without one more fix of jerk. We need a little bit more. So, name Piggy's, but we're getting chicken. Okay. And some water, please. Yeah. All right, so we're gonna eat this right here on the car. Right on the car? Yeah, right on the car. So this is traditionally Jamaican, well, Caribbean, because I did this also in Barbados and I did it in Trinidad. Yeah, Post up on the car. car. Oh my gosh. Food. Can't lose our extra food. Well, you see the seasoning on that? Some jerk chicken right there. Yeah, man. Let's do this, man. Yeah, man. There's the piece I want. That is a piece for you. I will go with this piece. Perfect. Yeah. Chicken butt in our It's been sitting. The jerk seasoning on the outer there. On the outside. Mm -hmm. This one is seasoned to the bone, though. It's seasoning to walk right through. This is super the tender. The seasoning on this is incredible. It's amazing how it falls off so nicely. 
So it's supposed to be real tender and have that juice inside and it's supposed to be seasoned right down to the bone. I can eat chicken like this all day. This is the best. Little, I think it's called the bunt. Yeah, that's chicken butt. Chicken butt. Hey, so Port Antonio is the main city in uh, in this parish? Yes. Yeah? So it's the biggest city. Yeah, it looks like the biggest town. It looks really beautiful. The park right there is really nice. Yeah, I mean, I, I would love to have walked through the spice market right there and bought some spices. Some jerk spice? That's the one thing I haven't seen, mm. to buy some jerk spice. Mm. Yeah. Somewhere, bro. We'll find it. All right, guys, so after a long day, we're home. We made it. I can't believe it, but it was a beautiful uh, experience. That's jerk chicken. My man. Thank respect, you, bro. Respect, brother. Respect, yeah, respect, guys. All right, let's get that. Yeah, let's, right. go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Good morning, July 13th, 2023, and today in Kingston, Jamaica, I'm gonna see if I can visit every single KFC in Kingston. There's, uh, I think, 12 of them? I don't know, what do you guys think? You think I can do it? It's gonna be tough. But well, we got that, we also got some patties. Uh, it's our last day, beautiful day. Nah, not a scorcher, not yet. Look, Blue Mountains, Kingston, last day, let's rock. KFC all day, KFC. KFC and some, uh, what else? Some uh, patties. Patties? Uh, that's what I've been waiting for on this trip, is like patties. Our last day, bro. We're doing 500 KFCs? 500. No, there's like only 12 here, bro. So the KFC started in North Corbin, Kentucky back in 1952. September 24th was the first uh, day it opened. So, and then they changed their name to KFC back in 1991. So it was Kentucky Fried Chicken, then it was KFC. So the first Jamaican KFC restaurant opened uh, June 18th, 1975 at 170 Old Hope Road, Kingston 6. Are we gonna see that one or is that one really far? Um, we're gonna try to see that one. Okay, there are approximately 39 of the restaurants on the island today. Wow, 39. 39, might be might be 41 now because they opened two other and I'm not sure if they're updated that this. They say the chicken is juicier here than the US and Canada. They say it's way juicier. They use less grease They and then the, they use organic chickens that's raised on the islands. That's the biggest difference from the chicken. For, same thing in Trinidad. They have chicken on the island that's like slaughtered today, and that's what's cooked today. It's not like the US. All right, ready? Ready. Let's do it. Uh, we're going to try a beef patty. We're going to have to try a chicken patty. Hopefully they have a shrimp patty, and then we're going to stop at Devon House for a curry goat patty, which is massive. I think the curry goat patty is what I'm most interested in right now. <laughs> Sounds delicious. After eating all that curry goat, or is it goat curry? Curry goat. <laughs> <laughs> we can walk in. We thought it was only drive through, but no. We're gonna park and get off. Juicy patties. Oh. This is my first time trying Jamaican patties. Let's go inside. First time? First time, bro. Boss, that's I, I didn't tell you that. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, thanks, bro. Thanks. Let's go. So, patty, two patties. We're seeing it one patty each, right? Yeah. My, my first intro will be shrimp. What do you think? Uh, first intro has to be beef. Has to be have beef? To beef. Okay, okay, we're going beef then. But this is this. We probably should get a shrimp here as well. We're getting beef and shrimp patties. Serious Jamaican food. How you doing? My first time trying a Jamaican patty. Yeah, I'm excited. Yeah. So what are we getting? Uh, we're getting a beef. Beef, cheese, chicken, and shrimp. Well, we want to do beef and shrimp. Uh, just two. That's good. Yeah. So beef and chicken for him with the water. Um, and I'm good with the shrimp and beef. Yeah, yeah, so we're gonna break it up. Beef. Yeah. No, I bet you got two, two. Two, two? Perfect. Yeah. Let's do it. So 2,840, so that's like 20 US, something like that. Yeah. Right. It's a uh, 140 right now. 130. Right here. Woo! Your bank will give you that. Woo! It's taking so much money from me. <laughs> All right, it's fine. All right, so when you guys go to the first two or eight, you guys enjoy it. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Let's go. I'm excited. I'm hungry. Here we go. Look in there. Water. Let's go. Right here. All right, let's get this table. Let's 
some patties. Look at that, flaky. That's it, that's what we came here for. Basically an empanada. Shrimp. Shrimp. Those are the two shrimp. That's shrimp. It's so hot that we can't eat this yet. It's a hot party. That's how you have to eat it. You have we have to, to eat it like this? And blow it and let the steam get in the mouth and hot party. Are you serious right now? Yeah, 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 yeah. This is a shrimp. This is a shrimp party. It's too hot, bro. It's too hot. It's a hot party in here. Okay, let's do it. Are you reminding me of like a Cuban pastadito? Put the shrimp inside. Oh, that's good. Yeah, that's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Oh, I love the shrimp. Inside here, smoking. It is so hot. Amazing curry. It's incredible how this part of the world, fast food, is similar every time. Empanadas. No, Jamaican patties. This is the beef. This has to be beef. And this way, even hotter. Oh, this is hot. Yeah. So how do we pick it by? In right the middle? Top, top. Right, right on top? top. That's the flakiest part. Come on. Right on. Nice and right buttery. On. Buttery and crunchy and flaky. Scotch bonnet in here? Mm. I'm gonna fold it like this. Oh, this is amazing. Come on. You know, you must have this with you. A cocoa bread. Oh yeah? Patty and cocoa bread. So the next stop will take, you have to bite the patty with the cocoa bread. We put it in it and create almost like a burger. But you, so the patty is in the middle and the bread folds it over and it's buttery, soft, sweet. Oh wow. Yeah, that's amazing. Look how the flakiness. It's that's the biggest difference from um empanada that I've had in, in Miami. Cuban, Argentine, whatever it is. Mm. It's hot, but you know what would really make it spicy? David's been here. I'm gonna do it on the beef. Mmm. Oh yeah. Dude. So unreal. The flakiness texture. And now it's cool. Now it's not too hot. Oh, the nice spice. It needs it. You know the problem is? This is the first stop of the day and I'm enjoying it so much I need to slow down. Maybe not. And what I love about Jamaica is that we're here filming inside a restaurant with the mad people around us, and it's fine. Yeah, everybody good. Everybody's in their own business. It's good. Oh, it's really good. It's a kind of a curry, curry flavor, crispy, flaky crust. That's the way. I, this is what I've been dreaming of. So we're talking about food management here. You know, load management in the NBA. Food management. How do I eat at seven places today without popping? Thank you, thank you. You're so nice for letting us film here. Thank you, thank you. Let's go, let's go. And that's Jamaican fast food, patties. I love how the whole world has taken on these meat loaf, these meat pies and made it into something. You got somsas in Uzbekistan, you have samosas in India, you have empanadas in all of Latin America, and here we have patties. Same thing with a different twist. So I already ate almost like two and a half patties. Still got six more places to go today. We're going to like three KFCs, we're going to two more patty places, plus we're going to eat pastas and oysters tonight with ganja sauce. This is going to be intense. I don't know how my stomach's going to deal with it. I mean, I definitely gained weight on this trip already. Oh, every day has been a struggle. Dude, I don't know how we can eat like this. I can't do the 10 days straight. I would have died. Four, four is enough and then I take a big break. A lot of Lebanese here, but we're not here for Lebanese food, we're here for patties. So what is this place called? This is Mother's. This is another one of the franchises that sell patty, and one of the original patty franchises in Jamaica. Mother's right here. I had the logo, a little flower. Good morning, all is well? All is well, how about you? Yes, Everything good here at Mother's? Yes, sir. welcome to Lake and the Mother's, all right? Best beef patties? What do you think? We're in a search for the best, best beef patties. Definitely Mother's. Mother's? Definitely. Okay. Let's get in line. This is a big line. Yeah. Oh, that way around? All right, all right, let's go. Wow, it's big. Do they have a bathroom? I'm like... Uh, yeah. Oh, they do, right there, right there. Party, cheese, chicken party, full house party, power party, which is a soy party, fish party, bacon and cheese party, pork party, curry goat. Wow, yeah. that's a lot of selection. Curry goat? Hey, how you doing? How you doing? You have any pork party, miss? 
report party. I don't know the report party no more. Um, okay. You have, you have fish party? Fish parties? I feel like everything's out. Yeah, what happened here? What we have here, one fish and a cheese. And a cheese. Yeah, perfect. How much is it? Um, we find that um to go for ten minutes on the fish. Within ten minutes. Hey, yeah, we ordered. Yeah, 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 yeah it's great. Yeah, sure. No problem. So the patties here the best. I want to search for the best Jamaican patties. The best? Are they the best? Okay. I don't know. You tell me. She's gonna tell you. But you haven't eaten the patties. You eat the patties too. Come on. Tell him, sir, the best party. Yes. All right, Drew, I'll taste the beef. That's right. I don't know, man. What party we're there for? F food management. Come, really. give me a Jamaican. We're there for the, pa for the party. We're there for the parties. We're there for the party. We're there for the parties. Yeah, Fee is, is four. Fee. Four. Fee. D is D. We're there for the parties. There for the party. Thank you so much. We got our two parties. Let's go sit down. Sing here. Right, let's just sit right here. Let's pull these out. Scorching hot. I a hot patty. Hot patty. So we got fish and we have cheese. Now which one is which? Mm. Cheese. I think that was cheese, yeah, yes. Cheese. <laughs> <laughs> right here we have fish. There's cheese. Yeah, man. Let's open this up. Break it up. Ooh. Break it. Look at that. We're getting some cheese for guys. Oh, so it's cheese hot, and hot, it's hot, meat. Hot, hot, yeah, cheese and beef. Oh, I got it. Yeah, man. Oh, hot. That's a hot fish. Party. Oh, too hot, too hot. Yeah, can't, yeah, I can't. Yeah. This is like this is like extreme. But everybody eats like this. Cheese and beef. Right. Yeah, man. We get it until it burn the top of your mouth. So we'll do this one first. A lot of people love cheese party here. Let's go. Oh yeah, it's a cheeseburger. Jamaican cheeseburger. In a patty. <laughs> That hit the spot right there. That's the best one so far for me. The cheese party? Yeah, the cheese party. Jamaican. Oh my god. Most Jamaicans love a cheese party. The, yeah? I'm a traditionalist. So I'm old school. I like the. I'm going fish now. Yeah. Alright, so this is my first time trying a mother's fish party. It, you know what it reminds me of? Oh, kind of like, a clam, like a clam chowder inside a patty. It's like, like creamy. Chowder? Yeah, because it's like a creamy, almost like a fish chowder. Oh, mm hmm. I got you know. It's like potatoes in there, the flakiness, doughy, more than two bites today. In here, about four. Oh. Mm. Yeah, man. So I'm worth sorry. it. This is good. This cheese patty, out of the four so far, the best one. They use a mother over juicy so far. Yeah. I think so. So far. You know what it reminds me of? One of these Lebanese pizzas, or uh, like Turkish pizza. La ham, la, eh, la majun, la majun, but not lamb. Hey, that cheese, that cheese patty, the ultimate patty, man. So good. Blessed, blessed. So, we're next door. Great. What does we have them think the fish patty was awesome, but we have to try a tasty cheese patty as well. So juicy, tasty, tasty and mothers. mothers. And then we have the one more at Devon House Bakery. After. What? A fourth curry one? Good, curry good patty. Oh my gosh. These pies are too good. They're too good. They're different from the empanadas from Cuba and Argentina. Flakier. 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 More bakery. Yeah, more bakery. More crust. More butter. And we're finally walking in the streets of Kingston. Jamaica, we have a bobsled team. <laughs> Son, are you dead? Oh wow. Line. Always. Always. Are those all of them? Or no? Those are not the... Hi, how are you doing? See if I have a 580 right there. Perfect. So we got a beef and a cheese. Beef and a cheese. Good. Just to compare the beefs, because we had a little beef in everything so far. Thank you so much. And it's the original. Let's do it. Thank you. One down, one to go. Thank you. Thank you so much, bro. Let's go. Now I'm trying Tasty's beef patty. Take a nice bite. Mm. Another spices in the minced beef. Mm, so flaky. I'll try it first. Yeah. You, you like the cheese patty better than any patty? You know what it is? The cheese is better. 
The cheese is better here. So oh. They make their own cheese here. What kind of cheese is it? Like cheddar? Or? It's tiesta cheese, tin cheese. That's all we know. Uh, this is what we have with bun and cheese. Is it a white cheese? Type of cheese? No, it's a, it's a cheddar. It's a cheddar it's, cheese? Yeah. It's very nice, this one. All right. I'll say, I might say this is the best one so far. Oh, with the cocoa bread. Excuse so me. if you look at the shape of the cocoa bread, mm -hmm. so it is, this fits perfectly in there like this. Like that? Yeah. And then... Like a beautiful sandwich? Yes. It's so sure. cheesy, it's like gooey. I, look at that. Oh, perfect. Yeah, man. So this is the sandwich. Oh, We're ready for this bite? For the, oh, I'm ready. Cocoa bread. It's like a Philly cheese steak. Oh. Oh. <laughs> That's what it feels like. Nice fluffy bread, the cheese. Mmm. I love the spices you in the meat. To, you go straight to Philly cheese. That's one of my favorite things, you know. Mm -hmm. Philly cheese steak. Philly cheese steak. At this point, we have to bring out the sauce. Angelo's cheese steak. That's Angelo's, Angelo's. Angelo's. Oh my gosh. I can't hold back with this one. The coconut and the bread. What flavors? Soft. With the crunchy, with the heat, you not know, well, and it fill your belly. Yeah. Most importantly, it fill your belly. Then I suggest as soon as you get the cheese, you throw it in the bread. It actually mm -hmm. hot because right now it's cool. It's not yeah. as hot. When it was dropped, when it just came and it was melting and it was phenomenal with that bread, mushy, cheese steak, gooey. Last tiny bite. Uh, one more part to go. One more. Go curry. Curry good. Curry oh. go. <laughs> I'm too used to my Trinis, bro. Big up with Trinidad, man. Oh, dude, we have to watch the, the food. Food management. That's too much food. And right here on the wall behind me, we have the history of Tasties from the 60s oh, all the way till today. 60s, 70s, 80s, 90s, and today. Wow. That was it. That was it. So we got one more spot, and it's Curry Goat. Curry Goat party. That was Tasty. David is loving the cheese patties. Loving the cheese patties. I cheese patties are the best, guys. Wins. Cheese patties always. It's like a burger in your mouth. Cheeseburger. Okay. Respect, bro. Respect, bro. Thanks, bro. Thank you. Everybody's so friendly on the streets. Yeah, man, it's Jamaica. It's one love, you know. One love. Bob, Bob Marley right wasn't lying when he said one love. Nah, he was not. And we have a South Indian restaurant right across the street. I mean, I would go there right now, but you know, today is a crazy day. We're doing this tour, plus we're doing KFC, plus we're doing pastas. What am I doing to myself? <laughs> Food management, I need uh, Greg Popovich to help me out. You know, he, he helped Tim Duncan, Tony Parker, Mount Ginobili. I need some help. My stomach. Give me a break. So right here we have Bob Marley's museum. Yeah, so that's the reason we're not going there is because we can't film inside. So it's very unfortunate, but you should, you should definitely check it out when you're in Kingston. Go to Bob Marley's museum, respect the legend, watch the movie Bob Marley, One Love. It's coming out, and of course, listen to the greatest album of all time, Legend. So we're back at Devin's house. Uh, Devin House. Devin House, and this is where we came uh, two days ago, and we were here eating a pizza with my boy, Max, uh, Italiano, yeah, Jamaicano. I think that's how you say in Italian, uh, Jamaican. Uh, great pizzas. He's also opening up a bakery here. And tonight we're coming here to have some spaghetti and some uh, some oysters with ganja sauce. But right now we're gonna have a patty. Yeah, I'm excited. And of course the history here is pretty cool too. Just that it was converted into this, you know, from a, it was a mansion you said, a villa or a mansion? Yeah, it was the it was the first millionaire of Jamaica's house. He turned his house into like a a food uh, center back at Devon House. And right over here we have the biggest, the biggest one of them all. Jamaican patty. So we're gonna go inside here, Devon House Bakery, to have a massive, massive Jamaican patty. Curry goat, goat curry, whatever you wanna call it. It's huge and it's delicious. All right, hello. The patties, the big patties, which yes. one? We need a curry goat patty. Curry goat patty. Yeah, have lots of Over here. No. Nate, lemon danish for you, bro. Uh, I'm not sure I could eat any more, man. I'm like Curry goat patty. I almost said goat curry, but it's curry goat patty. So one big one, right? It's massive. Yeah, we need a massive you read my shirt? Yeah, yeah, you know what? If you want, you can try the sauce. You want spice? We're gonna put it with the patty right now. Aw, oh, what happened? You were so awesome. Why why did you want to get out of the frame? No, you were doing good. So I have a YouTube channel and today. Yeah, and he's also a YouTuber. Um and I Dun 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 dun. This is big? How big is this? 
It doesn't look so big to me. Oh, this looks like a like a like a massive empanada. Woo! This is gonna be hot and flaky. I think we should go outside, right? If not, we're gonna make a mess. Let's go. I'm making movies today. <laughs> you ready for this? Yeah, man. Well, gonna open it. Oh, it's it's ah! It's Kurt. so hot. Hey, this is Kurt Gold. Remember what happened to my hand yesterday? It's still burning. Oh my gosh, dude, it's scorching. Yeah, man. Look at that. You see, it's steaming out. It smells great. Yeah, you see a little scallion, little spices in there. Oh, yes, oh, yes, there. right there. This is gonna be an easy bite. I'm not giving it extra seconds. Born ready. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know what, this is like India right here. Intense goat, curry flavor. That goat is well cooked. This is the best one. This beat the last one. This is the best one. <laughs> right here at Devon House Bakery. Oh my gosh. The curry. The no, spices, of course, the curry. The flaky crust that holds it and it's still flaky. All that moisture from the curry and it's still no mushy it up or make it soft. Dude, it's so good. If you're gonna have one, one patty, come to this one. I think the influence here is the Indian population that came here as indentured service. Second largest. Um, ethnicity in Jamaica. 36,000 indentured laborers came in the 1800s. So it has a huge influence in the food, in yeah. everything that we consume. Yeah, very so. similar to Guyana and to, um, and to Trinidad. Caribbean. This is you so know. yummy, <laughs> this is so yummy. <laughs> Still hot. Wow. By the way, they have an amazing coffee shop in there. You should go there. It's like a little New York type of spot. Two tables, very nice and cozy. But they also right next door, a shop where I got this hat and I got myself some trousers and some, uh, some souvenirs for my kids. So, very nice stuff. Love this place, Devon House. All right, so we're back here at the KFC. This is the one we came to this morning. Yes, the one that's with less traffic, we check first. There's less traffic here? It should be, this one has less traffic than any other around. Yes, yes. So what, how are you on feature today? My man, he is famous. Barbecue, Barbecue singer. singer? Yeah, it's a man. All right, let's do it, let's do it. Here, let me help this guy out. Man, this is, this is a big line here. Come, come, come. You ready, bro? What are we getting, everything? Definitely, I forget a zinger. Definitely, I forget some spicy chicken. And definitely, I need some barbecue. Now, this is a real line, huh? Yeah, this is. I, this didn't, is I didn't expect this. This is not. There's nothing? This is not. I think I want that barbecue, though, that barbecue, barbecue zinger. Spicy barbecue. We're going to have to cut it in half, man. Yeah. Yeah. Cut that in half. So, what do you think we're going to get? Because we're going to a few today. We're going to like at least at least two. We're not getting everything on the menu right now. There's a 99.63% chance that we get everything on the menu. <laughs> <laughs> Teaser. <laughs> and mean, we've got the crispy, the crispers, popcorn. We also have wings. We have box. We have the barbecue zinger, which is a specialty item right now. I mean, he's saying that this is nothing. This is this is light. This is one of the less trafficked ones. That's why we came here first. Less traffic. It, yeah, it's, it's full, but this is not. I mean, we're waiting easily, like what, 20 minutes? Let's say 20 minutes. He looks like he knows a place where you can ask him. If you know a place? <laughs> well, what's, what's the one, the <laughs> longest way? Sometimes you come here and you're like, it's like all the way around the corner, so. No way. Yeah. It's that good? Yeah. What are you getting today? Me, I'm going to get a, I don't know, I might try a zinger, or I might get a, you know, wings, so I'm not sure yet. By the time I reach up by the front, I'll decide. So, just have to wait and see. Of course. It's right here. Yeah. So first thing it says right here is like, please ask for permission. So let's ask. Is it okay if we film? What are we getting? A zinger we big box? No, just a zinger. We let's get a big box. Let's get. We have to try a zinger. Can't come Jamaica and not have a barbecue zinger. Spicy barbecue zinger. This is what we want. Just we don't want Pepsi, we want water. It's a big line behind us. And uh, the area where you're waiting is like super tight. So everybody's like this, just waiting for the food. But it's pretty quick. We're number 3159 and we just spent uh, $15, like I said, uh, 1930 That's what I came here for. Perfect, thank you. Where is she? Where is she? She's right around here. Just to watch, you know. Where? Where she got here? Met the cashiers. Yeah? <laughs> How are you? I'm David. Well, how are you? 
Pleasure. Nice to meet you. That's What's your name? Awesome. Michelle. 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 Yeah. Awesome. Awesome. Right. So you're a fan? It's amazing. Thank you so much. Appreciate you. Thank you. So you ready for this, bro? You got the zinger? I got the zinger. Ready for the zinger. Ready for the KFC. Jamaican and KFC. And so inside we have a chicken breast. Oh, you get barbecue? Get yeah, a little bit. That's how I love. Yes, man. This is exciting. This is the boss right here. Oh, I'll bacon on it. Um, bacon, so it's barbecue crispy, barbecue crispy zinger. zinger with bacon and crispy onion and all that. Wow, what a monster! Ooh, look oh, at look at that. that! It's onion ring, onion. it's crispy, onions. crispy onions. I don't know, man, that was really good. This is only KFC good. One. I mean, yeah, it has bacon as well. There's actually 42 KFCs here in Jamaica, yeah, man, and around 15 in Kingston, yeah, around that. <laughs> it's a lot. Ready? Ready for it? Mm hmm. When I was growing up, my go to was chicken sandwich, but at Wendy's. At Wendy's. I love that Wendy's spicy chicken sandwich. Let me do. Well, that or the Chick fil A, but. Cheese, bacon, amazing juicy chicken. Oh and man. That bacon had a nice flavor with that bite of the barbecue sauce. Plus the crispy onions. People sing about this in Jamaica. They have dancehall and reggae artists. Well, dancehall artists that sing about this. I'm telling you, this is amazing. It is like it's wetting my mouth, man. One of the best dancehall artists tell you, say barbecue. And barbecue. it has it has barbecue, but not like crazy man barbecue. No, it's like barbecue. I almost thought that it wasn't barbecue when I started. Mm -hmm. I'm so used to the barbecue sauce being lighter than it, like the chicken itself. They know I usually tell them about the fries. It sucks. KFC need to step up the fries. Man. KFC fries, oh, not my favorite. No. What is this? That is a barbecue mesh. See, I thought the barbecue chicken uh, zinger was more this color. Me too. That's what I thought as well. That was the thing. I thought it was more this color, but... I thought it had that, that complexion, that color, smothered with barbecue sauce. So when I saw it, I was like, is that barbecue? Because that's what I'm used to being barbecue. KFC is known for juicy chicken. The breast should break right apart, should fall right apart and still be juicy. <laughs> I'm taking this small piece. <laughs> This is my favorite mm. I might have to take more than that. Hot. Like Chinese restaurants? Glazy chicken? Like a Panda Express? Mm-hmm. Honey glazed chicken. Oh. Boy. No. It's still juicy. Look at that. So juicy? So what happened? What happened? Tell me. <laughs> so we're going to the first one ever um, established here in Jamaica. Yeah. Line, let's see, let's see how long the line is. Let's see, we check it out. Thank you. Thank you. Bye, guys. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Let's go. It's hard sometimes. We're like literally in people's faces with cameras. Where's the car? KFC was good. I don't know if they'd be Trinidad yet. We'll see. KFC Jamaica? KFC Trinidad? Who's gonna win? So that was the original location, and this is how many we have in Kingston at the moment. There's the, roughly around 40 on the entire island. But it's how much we have here, just in this area. If you wanted to do them all, it would take about three days. So I guess we're going to New Kingston? Old Hope Road. Old Hope Road. Which is the road that the original one was It's not that full. The line to the drive through is big. Yeah. Rock and roll? The original. Boom. Yeah. The home of KFC. It's good. So we ain't spicy chicken? Yeah, we have to get a spicy chicken and an original. We had the barbecue already. We had the barbecue as well. We need something original. The crispers look good too. The crispers look good. With some sauce. Beef. With some David's in here. Put that one in. <laughs> we have to, we have to. Today we're doing it. And the spice, it has more crust, more flakes on it, like the hot wings would. Can we get a meal deal? We want a spicy and an original. Half of spice, spicy, don't. Which one you prefer? And then one crispy barbecue zinger. crispy barbecue Whoa. Just regular zinger? Only regulars here. Yeah, one regular. Barbecue? Yeah. 
barbecue zinger. Right. Yeah. So what's the damage? I only have 100. This is the, this is the first KFC yeah, location ever, right? That's spicy? That's spicy. You see how it's fit more flaky? Thank you. Thank you. All right, all right. All right. Uh, sorry. Thank you so much. Let's go. Ready? Yep, Ready? let's go. Run it. What else we got in here? Fries? What up? Don't know. No, man. That was like broth. Oh, some fries in here? Perfect. Let's go. Yeah, man. You open that up. Unbox that goodness. Ooh. Just gonna open it like that. Let's get the fries on top of the spicy chicken. Got two pieces? Spicy one is original. We had barbecue already. That is what we call a rib. That is the original. Bring it in half? You can brought that in half. Did you think you tear that? Oh. Oh, it's so juicy just you know, coming off the bone. You know, I'm giving a bigger piece this time and you ah. <laughs> This is the original. It's on the skin. 11 herbs and spices, that's it? Mm hmm I love it. Mm-hmm. Oh, this is so juicy. It's ridiculous. Way juicier than any KFC I've had anywhere else. It's like crispy with the amount of juices coming out of the meat. Probably good? The one yeah. I had was crispy on it. How's your? Mm hmm Not crispy and salty enough for me. Need more salt. Where are you coming from, Belgium? <laughs> what great chicken. Mmm. The spice is so good. No, no, it's good, it's good. Yeah, yeah that's what I'm saying. It's not even spicy. Wait till you taste the spicy. Let's taste that. So it's just drumstick. It's a champagne, this. No, that's grape. Sparkling grape soda. Grape soda. Oh, let's do it. You need the skin on this. This the is the spicy. Back right into that. Not so spicy. No, not nice pepper. Light heat, yeah, man. No, usually I'm like super excited about the the skin, but for this, I'm excited about the meat. Yeah, the meat's juicy. It just melts right away. Mmm. That pressure fry. I mean, y'all try it. Take your fingers right after this. Let's go. One more. You know, we wanted to make this video interesting. We were like, let's eat KFC. Let's not eat the entire menu at one place. Let's show you a few of them. Again, 40 plus KFCs in all of Jamaica. It's been great. It's in the car. What do you think? What's next? Which, yes. which one though? Which one? Uh, around 15 minutes on Constant Spring Road, back to where we came from. So Perfect. it was wrapping right around again. Is this the best KFC in the world? Absolutely. I had to get it to take home to New York for all my friends and co-workers. So you guys, make sure it's not Fish and Bummy anymore. It's only KFC on the plane going home all the way. You going on the plane right now? I'm going on the plane right now. I'm going to New York right now and she had I'm to stop to at KFC. No way. She had to stop at KFC. I'll show you my flight. Right now, I'm catching the flight. Spicy wings, spicy wings, I like that. Oh gosh, what a day, what a day. This is nuts. The amount of food I've eaten today has no words. But I've been, uh, I've been hunger management. <laughs> hunger management? No, food management. So this last KFC, we're gonna go through the drive through We wanna get that experience. Um, it's basically a lady talking through a little speaker, and we're gonna order some more chicken. Some more KFC. Can't wait. I have not had my fix of KFC today, and... You need it? I need it. So we're gonna be eating on the car, Jamaican style. So we're in the drive-thru and there's like easily 25 cars. Let me see. So we got two behind us. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine cars. So we're behind nine. We were, I mean, we're behind six. So we're the seventh. There's nine total. We were in this line for already 15 minutes. It's crazy. It's gonna take us another like 30 to 40 to get through here. Just to order one thing for you guys. One thing to finish this video. What a line. Yo, this hot beef. You outside, what are you doing? Working off some of that food? Yeah, Come bro. inside, let's get some more. <laughs> okay, so we finally made it to the front of the line. I think we're gonna go with some hot wings. Five pieces, what do you think? Five pieces? Five piece hot wings? Five piece hot wings. Anything else? I think that's good, bro. That's it? Um, 
everything on the menu? No. <laughs> super spicy, super spicy. As spicy as you can make it. As spicy as you can make it. Spicy wings. I don't know whatever you want, bro. Pepsi. Pepsi is fine. And what else? That's it. That, that's all. Thank you. Huh? That's a all. A water, water, water. A water, wa a water. And a water, please. Drunk nights right there. Right here. Yeah. When it rolls down. Yeah, show me. That would hurt. Man, if that happens to my car, I'll be pissed. Yeah. It's like, why did I come for food? Thank you, hon. Thank you so much. All right, let's go, guys. We got it. KFC, third spot. We're very fortunate. There is a spot for us right here in front. I mean, literally, we just 10 seconds outside. Should we eat right here? Yeah. Like this? Perfect. Let's just sit right Let's do it. Here. Ready? Ready. Let's do it. Bam. Oh, yeah. Come on. This one has more spice than the last one. And way juicier. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, the wings is where it's at. Hot wings is the king down here. Mm hmm. Huge. Next time I do a competition, how many can you eat of these? Mm -hmm. 100. They, can't, they don't have enough for me. No, enough for you. Is there anything left in here? Yes, I got one more. It's a spice on spice. Spice on spice. Right there. Let's show you how you with spice. I'm ready. Let me show you how tender this is out as well. You ready? Mm hmm. Done. You went fast. I was trying my best to get everything at one go. Mashed chicken dog. I'll say it. The wings are the best. The wings and the first chicken that we had with the zinger? Yeah. Those Barbecue two are the best. Chicken. My favorite. The wings, the spicy, the flavor, the juiciness. Yeah. And David's been here. Hot sauce. Out. <laughs> so I had to do my own shout out. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video here. KFC Jamaica in Kingston. Thank you so much. This was a three KFC episode. One, two, three KFCs. Everything gets shelled down. Check it out. So we're almost done with the day. Almost done with the trip. We have one last stop. We're going back to Devon House. We're going to have some ganja oysters. And we're also going to eat some pasta with some herring. It's a fusion. More Italian slash Jamaican. My man, exciting. Yeah, man, and Max supposed to link us over there as well, so I want to hear you talk more Italian. Oh, yeah? The that you were asking me about down there, that's another one. So you see, parking would be horrendous because we can't stop there or anything. And we're back at Devon House. This is a 19th century mansion built by George Stiebel, the first black millionaire in Jamaica. This is his residence. They changed this when the, I think the government bought it, and then they turned it into like a I guess a mix of restaurants, bakeries, cafe, you also have a gift shop. We made the, so the, we have over there the pizzeria where we went the other day. And over here we have Steakhouse on the veranda where we're going tonight. We're going to have some oysters with kanja sauce. So it's going to be a funny night tonight. And then we're also going to make some pasta here, red herring pasta. By the way, over here we had the, the patties, the best patty of all time. Go curry or curry go patty. Let's go. Let's rock and roll, bro. So how many are we getting? I want a whole bucket. A whole bucket? I want the bucket. I know, they're, they're small, we need to get a lot. A dozen is not enough. No, I need a dozen like, is not enough. Like two or three dozen? At least, minimum. Four dozen? Five, six. Six. So the oysters that we have here in Jamaica are super razor thin. Look at that, like yeah. a sheet of paper, super flat. What did you call these? Flat oysters. Flat, flat oysters. oysters. Flat oysters. Yeah. Yeah. And you have copper oysters. And copper oysters. So you have the smaller ones and they're bigger ones, so that's yeah, the difference? Yeah, that's the yeah. So the, these are not so flat, these are flat. Yeah, the flat one, these ones are more good to maintain it, more effective. Have everything in it, zinc, iron, everything. The everything. flat one, more stronger. Got it. More stronger. This one, you know what it's like an egg? Mm -hmm. It's more stronger. How, how's the ganja sauce, by the way? Uh, I would like to hear. Does it get you up in the air, or is, it uh, that, is that a myth? Is a, is a, is a like a oh, it's right there? It's like a medicine. If you have bad coughing, bad sneezing, huh? Can I, can I do a quick try? Yeah, man, try Is that man. okay? Oh, it's like a honey. Yeah, like a honey night, garlic. Oh, that's addictive. 
Yeah, we had oysters the other day, the first day I got here to Jamaica. The guy had a similar sauce, but oh, this is like, you feel this. Okay. You feel it. Yeah. It's good stuff. So this is our plate. Yes. Wow. Look at this. This is so beautiful. I don't remember the last time I was this excited for oysters. This is so heaven. I've never had a chance to have like so much. And usually I don't want to spend the money. <laughs> it's like, it's, in Miami, it's like, man, a dozen oysters, a hundred bucks. Yeah, but bucks. you're getting a big cup no, of I know, sauce. I know, I know. All right, so no, this sauce is the ganja sauce. This is the Jamaica oyster sauce. But this is also the Jamaica oyster sauce because it have the scotch bonnet peppers, it have the pimento, and it have onions and natural honey from Jamaica. So no ganja, ganja. No ganja, ganja. Okay, so spicy and... Spicy and... and the, the one that gives you wings. Yeah. Not the Red Bull of sauces. <laughs> well, we have a lot of oysters. I can't wait, dude. So excited for this. Trust me. Let's go. Let's go, let's go. Ready? Ah, oh, that's a little baby. Mm. Mm. I love that. Ooh, Scotch bonnet. Yeah, I got the seed right there. <laughs> you want the milder one? No, no, no. I like this a lot. It's a nice heat. This one's not as uh, sweet as the... Um, the weed one. The ganja. Mm. Oh, that beef is just mellow and nice. Yeah, it's funny because he was like, I think we're going to have the whole thing. Dude, yeah, easy. I definitely easy. would have the whole thing with ease at out. Woo! My hand was cracked. <laughs> <laughs> you got pepper seed in here? Trying. Oh, you have a little pepper, pepper seed there? Seed there it here. is. Yeah, man. We're just binging this. I went into this sauce. I have to try some more. Oh, look at that drip on They could tell that one's more um, thicker, more honey. Yeah. Mm. It's amazing. The wings sauce, Jamaica wings. You know what? Try some more. David's been here. We'll do it together. I need this one though. A little more sweetness on it. I think so. Yeah, mine, mine is like too spicy for it. Here's a mild one as well. Oh, guys. That's it. We're going ham now. Who needs medium? The Jamaican? I thought you needed it. No, bro. I need more it's ganja. <laughs> it's amazing, guys. What a place. I love Devon House. Nah, I'm just trying it, right? The mouth's a joke in terms of spice. Once you try the, the, the spice, it's hard to go back. I like these, the smaller ones, a little sweeter. That ganja's good. It's the best, come here, come on. It's the best ganja I've ever had. <laughs> Slurping. I'm getting heat. I'm getting sweet. I think this is the first time I've done oysters on, on my channel. Mm. It's amazing. What an experience. Feeling oystered out. <laughs> no, not yet. This bottomless pit ain't ready to be full right now. And no time. So can't have it. Make you have one last one. This is Jamaica. And Jamaica we share with the neighbor. If you pick up breadfruit, you get them half. Oh, that's so nice. If you pick from Yaki tree, you get them half. If you pick in mango, you get them some. So, cheers. Cheers. Hello. Hello. Done. You want more? Pasta? Amanda? Let's see what the fuss is about. Sorry, it's Christmas tree, usually. But I put it in beer now. That's a red stripe. <laughs> Dude, that's the best red stripe I've ever had. <laughs> the sorry. Yes, bro. Look at that. It's like a pink. It's like a rosé. <laughs> it's a rosé beer, bro. We're in the kitchen. What's up, guys? How you doing? Everything good? Everything good? All right, all right. Where's the pasta? Out? This way? Hello, hello, hello. Is everything good? 
What's up, guys? How you doing? Pastas? What we got? That's them. These are them. I'm ready for some fusion Jamaican pasta. Me too. Thank you, bro. Thank you. Bless, bless. What's up? What's up? What are we doing here? Final meal has to be epic. True Jamaican fusion apps. Scotch bonnet pepper on all. Perfect. Grandma's tuna tartar with scotch bonnet and scotch bonnet rub on top of a bone marrow. Can't get better than that. The idea is to put everything on the bread. That's a lot. Like That's butter. A lot. Look at That's that. Yeah, man. That is a lot. That's a lot. That is good. No, we don't need some more bread. That was a lot of bone marrow. Oh my gosh. You do find that this is a little different from what you get in the States because this is a grass fed animal as opposed to a farm fed. So it's a lot of dirt here. It's like fat butter. Yeah. <laughs> fat butter. You try it already? You ready? Oh yeah, I'm ready. With Scotch bonnet? Mm. Nice and spicy. Very light, very light. Not, not, not that big. When we were feeding a foreigner. Come on. <laughs> My god. I love it. Mm. So oily. So creamy. Flavor. Oh, and you feel the heat. That's the flavor. It's just a light tingle. Very nice flavor, very nice heat. And that salt just adds that added touch of something. You tell me what it is. Heaven. <laughs> Fresh tuna, avocado, and cocoa chips. Yeah, so cocoa is a root vegetable that we have here, uh, similar to taro. So this is easy. This yeah, is man, this is cocoa chips. Like this? Tuna tartar. I mean, that might, that might be a little spicy. Here, so. A little spicy. I don't, mind, I don't mind the spice. Need this plate. All right, let's go. Ready? That's one of my favorites. Love the tuna. That's ahi tuna, which is a yellowfin tuna, which we can find in, the, in our waters as well. They say that's the chicken of the sea. Yeah. So you can yeah. find everywhere. So chunky, it's spicy, a little spicy. It's, little uh, spicy. it's, it's, it's very little, light. It's light, light, light spice light. to me compared to the last two few days. I like that. Is there a hint of ginger in there as well? So yeah, I think so. That, 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 that the sesame. sesame dressing is on point. Oh, mm. I love that. With the avocado? It's no, it's good garnishing. <laughs> good garnishing. It looks. Wow. I can't stop. I'm sorry. Let's do this. Herring? Red herring. Red herring, get some shrimp. Nice and creamy. Al dente penne pasta. <laughs> what is it? Rigatoni. 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 No, it's not penne. Very creamy. Very creamy. You can feel the fish. Can taste it. Mm -hmm. It's almost like marlin dipping. I like the smoky shrimp. Yeah. Nice touch. Wow, Jamaican flavor. Yeah man, red herring is something that we use. The water crackers that we, we had before, usually put it on that and just have it as a snack. They sell it in bars all over Jamaica. This is good pasta. You know, I'm very particular with my pastas. I'm Italian. If it's not creamy, I don't want it. So no spice, but I feel something. This one's spicier. Scotch bonnet? You can look at it from the color. Starts out sweet. And then the heat. Then the heat. Ooh. Mm. It's almost like my sauce. Look at that sweetness. Mm. Killer. 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 Jamaica with this some is chicken. A coconut milk base. With lots of butter. So it's, it's, it's pretty good. Rich. That's why it's so good. You have to eat all of it. <laughs> you have to eat both. To be honest with you, 
I will go for a little more. You know, because I'm Italian, I rarely eat pastas now. I've like stopped. <laughs> mm. It's amazing. Great flavor. Yeah, All right, so that's the last meal I'm having in Jamaica. I'm not eating until tomorrow, 8 p.m. Let's see. <laughs> <laughs> Man, bless up, brother. Thank you, you don't bro. Know. Thank you. My pleasure. Respect. Respect. Every time. To make a buff. Oh. See you next time, bro. Bless up, bless up. Peace, Watch bro. Watch your ass knock you off right the right bro. That's it, that's it. <laughs> of course, that. Alright. How's it going? Let's go. Thank you so much. Thank you. You ready, Nate? That's it. We're done with Jamaica, man. Jamaica, 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 Jamaica. Yeah. Welcome to Jam Rock. Let's go. Let's put some reggae, some Bob. So we need to hear some Bob right now. Bob Panda Park. Yeah, I'm gonna have um, I'm gonna have one of them music right now. <laughs> and that's my apartment at the Brompton Six, right in the center of New Kingston. From here, it was super easy to get everywhere. Devon House is close. Tell me something in Jamaican Patois. You don't know, big up to all Jamaica 14 parishes, eh? Yeah, man, Bumba Ross, Clata Weedis, Global Empress International. We don't really knock off. Big up to all foreigners overseas. Salute. Man, eh? Where we come from? Uh. <laughs> oh. Love it, love it, love it, love it. You're great, you're great. <laughs> I, I want to follow here, Nate. And that's Bob Marley's statue. Thankfully, we saw this on the way out. We have like a little bit of time. We had to get that though. 